this game? Uh, is everyone gone who cares about spoilers? Uh, this was the guy we saw carrying, um, Captain Kupo after, you know, this happened. And the guy that called us Mythos. So he knows something. He knows something that's going on. But he's a Lord Commander of the Kingdom of Walud's armies. Um, and he accompanied his liege to Fort Zernitra in the Republic of Dalmachia. Cole, thank you for 60 months. Welcome back. After the karate chop. Yes. <laughs> thank you so much. So that's the thing that happened. Um, we have his powers now. Um, he carried him out. The Lord Commander, Royal Knight Lord Commander carried this guy and was like, no, did not bad mythos or whatever he said to us. Um, he's a part of the kingdom of Walud who has Odin's dominant. Um, the Holy Empire of Sambrek. We now know more about Olivier who is our mom's new kid. And she's using him for some shit. I don't know what she's using it for. Something suspicious. Um, let me, I can go R1 now. Okay. Uh, this happened. Which honestly, I'm not very excited about it. I'm not too excited about this. It was very cool, but I almost feel like it has now sealed his fate as uh, a potential bad thing happening. Because people, um... People turn to stone gradually when they use the powers. And he, Torgal, now... we're Actually, we're about to find out what's going on with Torgal. But Torgal now has those kind of powers, which makes me feel like bad things are going to happen. Uh, how did Clive meet Jill? Clive and Jill are childhood friends. Uh, his dad found her when she was a kid. They grew up together. Sid is who found um clive after the battle with jill and took them both to his hideaway or he will be the savior listen i'm just saying these guys are clearly gonna kill everybody and i'm just emotionally preparing myself for bad things i'm just emotionally prepared i mean i'm not exactly cal i'm prepared for bad stuff all the time <laughs> Uh, what's going on here? Okay. So, the Iron Kingdom has fled this because we killed Dr Drake's breath. Uh, Walud and the Men of the Rock are attacking Rosalith, which is what just happened. We, uh, we dealt with that kind of, a little, sort of. Like, look how big Sam Breck is. Like, all of this is the Kingdom of Sam Breck. They're pretty freaking big, although Walud also is pretty big. Um... Men of the Fist, which is the Dalmechian Republic, are over here against the Imperial Army fighting over the Crystalline Dominion, which is uh, a new Imperial capital. Uh, yeah, uh, you know, that's, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> yeah. The state of that's the realm it. is ever-changing, Clive. So I think we're ready for our next uh, thing. We we did all of our side quests yesterday. God damn it, there's a reading table for me. I'll trick it later. Shall we jump in? Uh, if you have any questions at any point and we need to clarify some of the lore, let me know. Um, but otherwise, let's go. Otto, is now a good time? Let's go. It's not a bad one. Oh, and Jill's not doing? feeling very well after no, using better. Shiva powers. Ty is making sure she gets the rest she needs. Good. Any word on uh, Sid's dead. Moment? Sid Tell dead. do what she can to try and track him, but she's feeding on scraps. We've sent owls out to the Curse Breakers and their other friends in the West, asking them to keep their eyes peeled for anything unusual. No leads yet. But it's only a matter of time. All right. Joffrey does have confidence. Let me know when you find something. That's for sure. There he is. Hello, who's that? All right, Clive. All right, Clive. Who are you? <laughs> uh, but yeah, so we we didn't want anyone to know that Sid had died because that would. It's like you know if you're in if you're in a, if you're having a if you're in a military combat 
and you're at war and then like the commander of one of the things dies that's gonna make everyone go oh guess we can go kill them all so you want to make sure that no one knows what's going on Dominant of the Icon Titan, Warden of Earth, on learning the identity of the one who slew his beloved Benedicta, he sends his forces to ransack Rosalith, capital city of Rosaria and Clive's former home, in the hope of drawing him out. Clive takes up the offer and is able to best Kupka in battle, cutting off his hands in the process. But before Clive can deal the finishing blow, the helpless Hugo is spirited away by a mysterious man from Walut. We know who it is! It's the Lord Commander! Busy saving the world. Hey, JWB. Mid. Mid. When did you get back? Wait, who the fudge is Mid? Mm, just now. Who's Mid? What about your studies? Ooh, her hair. Adjourned. Since Hugo Kupka invaded Rosaria, all the canvas in uproar about it. He's gone mad. He's turned rogue. It'll be us next. You try concentrating with all of that. All right, all I love right. Her. You win. I How love her. will you be staying this time? She's good. know. A while, most likely. Any road, while I'm here, I was hoping you could do us a favor. Mid, you can't just expect me to- Please, oblige her. You can brush that hair all day. <laughs> I love her already. While we are busy tracking down Kupka, you should have a little time to spare. Going on a Listen. joy ride? Now there's a face I haven't seen in a while. <laughs> Shouldn't you have it buried in a dusty old tome? <laughs> I did. Still a familiar trill pricked my ears. As ever, your exuberance is a breath of fresh air. It is. I like Which successfully scattered the painstakingly assembled fragments of my thoughts. I'll take that as a compliment. Well, Clive, you heard the professor. So, I'll meet you in the storeroom when you're done. Wait, hold on. <laughs> She's great. This is like a bundle of energy. Breath of fresh air. Bloody tempest, more like. <laughs> Oi, Otto. All oh, right, it's my the creepy guy. Huh? What are you all about? My fee for bringing Mid across. She said you were paying. <laughs> that little. <laughs> the storeroom was it? Does sound like something she would do. I don't even know anything about her, but it already seems like something she would do. Is she still being creepy? Blackthorn may be the manliest of men, but he does lack a certain tenderness. Goots, meanwhile, is as burly as a behemoth, but as innocent as a babe in arms. She likes Goots, I guess. She, who is she? She was creeping over someone Shouldn't else. Or initially. I guess she just wants to date literally anyone. <laughs> you took your time. Anyone will do. I'm a busy man, mate. I'll get to the point then. I want to turn the room down there into a workshop like the one I had at Dad's place. Mate, you've only just come back. Dad's place? Um, Dad's place what now? Uh, m ah, her name is Middadol Telemann. Student of engineering at the University of Canver, she is well versed in the secrets of modern and fallen technology as any scholar in the twins and means to put that knowledge to use in service of the hideaway. Pedro, thank you for 20 months. Welcome back. Thank you so much. An old friend of Otto's from his merchant seaman days, now serving as frame in between the shores of Benamir and Clive's hideaway. Knowing him to be a trustworthy and tight-lipped fellow, Otto invited him to join their cause after Sid's death, and he and his trusty skiff might help them build and operate their new hideaway on the lake. Okay. I've been thinking about it for a while. Went to university. Dad said I had a knack for engineering. Told me everything he knew about it. Then sent me off to Canva to learn everything he didn't. That was his dream for me. That one day I'd put my studies to use for the good of the cause. We've definitely heard the but name I'm before, no one's yeah. Stuck at school. Definitely. I've studied enough. It's time I put me neck to work. I'm gonna go visit the I Lord. I know table. that I can help the people here, and I want to do it. Well, well, well. It's sick at see you now. All right. Halloween. I'll tell Otto you'll be staying. Halloween. <laughs> I knew you'd say yes. Which is why I wrote up a list of jobs for you. Oh, jobs! I else? love jobs. 
What do you want me to do? First things first, I need equipment and materials to start. Does it involve home. murder? There's the designs for the stuff I need and the stuff it needs smithing from. The other materials I can work myself. Just need a generous benefactor to lay them on for me. Apart from the wood, I'll need a carpenter for that, but I can just borrow yours. I don't have Is a carpenter. Is that everything? Oh, I do for have now. a carpenter, apparently. I'll let you know if I need out else. Hell yeah, getting to work. I love her. I love her already. She's my favorite character ever. I love Where's her. Where start? Love Materials her. Materials and tools. All right, I gotta go visit the tombs. I gotta go visit the tubes. Uh, do we want to take a left or a right? What's faster? Probably a right. That means Karen and Blackthorn. Daughter Sid, it sounds like it with all of like the Sid would be proud. Sid would be proud. Sid could see you. Wish Sid could see you now. Sid proud. Proud Sid. Sidolphus. Penelon, or whatever their name was. Pelon? Pelamon. Pelamundo. Wait, where's the lore again? I forgot. Hmm, okay, okay, okay. We go to the mess and then we go up. The little ones have been up to Yeah, I just really, I really like her. I like her a lot. She's a little spark of joy in a world that so far has been uh, not joyful. Oh, do you have a new song? Oh, they do. Is a father figure to like everybody. Tom says he's looking for books about. He is looking for books about Torgal. Yeah. Is there something I might yeah, assist yeah, yeah. you with, Clyde? Yes. He needs to tell me about Torgal first of all. What's the prognosis, Doc? Yay! There is a rather fascinating excerpt I've been meaning to show you. The Holy Order of Shields? The official name of the Order of the Knights established in the Imperial Province of Rosaria who persecute and purge fairies. Oh, right. Right, 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 right. Yeah, right. Uh, commonly known as Black Shields after the color of their armor, a hue seemingly chosen to differentiate this new elite order from the silver-clad dragoons. Woo! <laughs> hey, Ginger, how you doing? Iron Kingdom, located on the Boiling Sea. Uh, it means charred rock, all right? Drake's Eye, a mother crystal which stood in the frozen wastes of the northern stormlands, now lost to the blight. Soon after the mother first fell, the tribes of the north, in a bit of desperation, marched south into Rosaria. She was dominant at their fore. A terrible battle ensued in which fire was pitted against ice, but eventually the phoenix and the ducal armies succeeded in driving back the invaders. I don't know if they were so much invading. Well, I mean, maybe they the were. Tomes? It literally, it's a Sid Spelter. <laughs> well, there's our answer, everybody. <laughs> Daughter of Sid and student of engineering at the University of Canver. From a young age, Mid showed the same passion for invention as her father and an even greater aptitude. She is, yeah, because it, there, it's got it right there. Sidolphus Helamon. Yep. There we go. Now we know. Oh, there's like, there's like lores. There's extra crystal lores. I mean, we don't need to read like everything because a lot You're of that we, welcome, we do know about. It just, it's giving like one line of extra knowledge or something. Hey, Cam. Have an itchy eyeball. Was wondering where you got to. Mid's back from Canva. Have you seen her? Yes. Just now. She's planning to set up a workshop in the stores and ask me to buy her some materials. Here's the list. Hey, Jog, how's it going? This is just a little bit of busy work at the moment, so you're not missing anything. Think you can find everything on there? This lot. Won't be much of a trader if I couldn't. Excellent. As for payment. It's paid. Hundred times over by what that girl's done for us. 
If it weren't for her filters, we'd have nought to drink but blight water. Oh, and that would have drained the life the out of us long ago. Nice. Indeed it would. I'll send the stuff on to Mid when it comes in. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Now, nah, Roy Kent's Blackthorn. gonna want some money. What's it look like? I have a commission for you from Mid. She requires certain tools. Supply kit. Finished Zelda today. Nice. Or not nice, actually. Do you think you can make them? Bloody hell. Was she planning to build with this stuff? An airship? Oh my god, no. it's Final Fantasy. Of course we're building an airship. Tell her I'll bring them over when I'm done. It's an airship. It's, an airship. My it's definitely an airship. And mids, no doubt. <laughs> Airships, SIDs, summons, moogles. That just leaves the carpenter. Let's see if Bardolph's available. Yeah, I totally get that. I totally understand that jog where it's like, just just not in the mood. Do I have to take the elevator? Oh, I do. Jill looked white as a sheet. I very rarely take the elevator. <laughs> How was your weekend, everybody? Although I was here for like all of your weekend. <laughs> I already know. Should be enough. So this is where the carpenter hangs out. How do, Master Sid? Didn't know that. Bardolph. Mid's looking to build a workshop in the storeroom, and she needs the aid of a skilled carpenter. So naturally, I thought of you. Well, I'd love to help the young miss however I can, but I'm afraid I got my hands full just keeping this place afloat. There's holes need patching, and if I don't patch them, will all right. of us sink into the we mere? We are on a ship. I'd gladly Damn spare it. mid all the time I have, but the sad truth is, I ain't got none. <sighs> I see. Cleaning my desk of... Bellicons. It don't have to be me, though, does it? What about that other fella? You know, the one over at Martha's Rest. You want me to go get that guy? Was it? That's right. Sure. And he is a friend of the cause. I'll ask Martha if she can spare him. Oh, Thank you, Chill. Part off. Oh. <laughs> Least I could do. Ba ba da da na ba ma na ma 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 ni ma ma meow 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 meow. That's what we're missing. We are missing a band of cats or chef cats. I watched a little bit of Sarah Daniels play today because she just started. So, like, I know that... I know <laughs> that she's, uh... What is that pointing to? What is that? Oh, it's my marker. <laughs> That's where the dude was. <laughs> Never mind. Mystery solved. Mystery solved. But it's hard for me to check where people are at in relation to me. So if they've just started, then I can I can totally watch with no problem. Everyone else is probably ahead what of me. What brings you to the rest? Because I am playing as uh, slow as possible. Home finds itself in need of an extra carpenter. Ever. I wondered if I might be able to borrow Big Bernard for a short while. Big I don't mind Big if he Lord. don't. We're all friends here, aren't we? Thank you, Martha. Do you know where I might find him? Oh, he's gonna be out somewhere. He went up to Cressida on business. See? No idea what, mind. Place is a ruin. Far as I know, he's still there. I'll look for him there then. <laughs> She's super pretty. Her eyes are really, really pretty. D2 servers have been struggling, <laughs> Yeah, a lot, the whole time. Hey, do I want to take, uh... Yeah, we just want to take this route. They were having trouble kind of all weekend. Okay, let us go, Ambrosia. Booters. They're only level 19. Like, I don't wanna. I don't care about those guys. They're pushovers. 
They turned the servers off yesterday. Yeah, they did. They did indeed. This seems to be the fella. His cart is broken, maybe. Oh, or there's things in the way. The lad who saved my life. What brings you to a place like this? I you do, you. Bernard. I'm kidnapping Martha you, Bernard. Said I might find you here. I have a proposition I'm for you. I'm kidnapping you. You're coming oh. with me. Do you know? And that is why you're coming with me. You don't have a choice. Get in my boat. Building a workshop, you say? <laughs> well, that beats tacking boards to bridges, sure enough. True. And if True. Martha didn't mind me being gone a while, then neither do I. You just tell me where you want me. <laughs> what a nice fellow. That's the spirit. I, uh, I couldn't ask a favor, though, could I? Before we go? Of course. Oh, you want me to kill those fellas? I know. Or something. What, you were building this? Well, that there is Cressida. It's Where cute. I grew up. Ain't much left of it now, though. Except my parents' graves. It's cute. We should rebuild it. But I, I came up here hoping to visit. I even patched up the bridge to get across. Only to find the place crawling with fiends. There are quite a few fiends, I'd say. But you're a dab hand when it comes to dealing with beasts and bogles, ain't you? Bogles. Any chance you could... Uh, is that like an Australian bogle? Thank you kindly. I think Dusty's doing okay at the care. moment. Server-wise. I think they're okay currently. Da, da, da. Man, you'd think that those scarecrows would keep them away. Turns out. No. This shouldn't take long. kill! <laughs> 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 Wait, what the heck? All yours, Toggle. Farewell. Too slow. Too slow. Hold on. Hey, no, never mind. <laughs> Alright, oh, I'm not on the thing. Stay down! This is me playing on a Titan. Was it overkill? Yeah. Woo! A big fella! Hello, big fella! Oh! I'm <laughs> Again. Do it. Oh, no, 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 no
close, close enough for me. Oh. One thing, we met Sid's daughter, and she is trying to build a workshop at home. So we're just do uh, doing some busy work at the moment. Uh, we're getting a you new carpenter to bring to the hideaway. This guy. Thank you, son. Now my folks oh, no, no, can rest no, no, in no, peace no, no. once more. That emote works pretty well for Oda. Oda. <laughs> I should get that animated. Although How I don't have any of the, the village was abandoned. PSD files anymore. Oh, people started packing their things after the duchy fell. Between the blight and the Imperials, Jill you is just couldn't resting. make ends meet. Must so, be nigh on a decade since the last okay, wagon left. She's okay, but she is resting. She's not oh, with us right now. It may as well right have been now. a century, looking at the place. This isn't the Cressida I remember. Do we have lore on Cressida? Oh, we do. A village located deep within the wetlands of central Rosaria. It was once the site of an aqueduct that was hoped would carry water to the capital, Rosalith. But these plans never came to fruition due to both the Holy Empire's annexation of the Duchy and a sudden influx of feral beasts displaced by the Blight's march south through the dim. Now it lies abandoned, many of its residents having fled to Martha's Rest. Uh, I think this is like the same invaded... Misery on the downtrodden populace. Yep. But it did say uh, loosening the Empire's grip somewhat. So the Empire has less of a grip on stuff. That's nice. That's good. I'm the sorry. birded lore is like, he's a carpenter. <laughs> he's a carpenter. Uh, he lives Can't in live Martha's in the past. Rest. No matter how nice it might have been. He's from As soon as I'm done saying a Cessna. prayer for those that raised me, it's onto your hideaway. I'll meet you there. We did it. We got a new carpenter. Or an extra carpenter, I should say. That should take care of Mid's little list. The handbag before she... Oh, sorry. Finish what you were saying. That's my bad. You finish. You finish. You finish. You, you finish. anything else. Okay. <laughs> if you got something... That's, if you got something in the carpet, he's going to get it done for you. The other carpenter is just trying to make sure that we stay afloat and don't die. So he doesn't have any time to, have been up to, their to deal with this. Again. Come on, Moogle, give me some more hunts, dude. Wait a second. Does he have another hunt? I only did one yesterday. He normally brings them in pairs of two. I hope. Oh yeah, the first, first carpenter. Carpenters are not having a very good time out of this. Carpenting's dangerous. And this is the new lady, Crosser. Sid's daughter. All right, Clive, you've all done then? I am. I've placed your various orders and a carpenter by the name of Bernard is on his way from Martha's rest. That's brilliant. Thanks, Clive. Is there anything else you need? Nope. Blackthorn and Lady Karen have already sent over everything I asked for, and I've got all my plans drawn. Our wife, up. yes, correct. So as soon as Bernard gets here, we can get to work. <laughs> I can't wait. I just think she's, she's, you know, she's just. She's a light in the darkness. What can I say? She is a light in the dark. Breath of Earth reduces wind up cooldown by three seconds. Thank you. That's my good deed for the day done. Let's see how Jill's Now playing. we're gonna go visit Jill. Did Bernard say how long he was gonna be? I mean, it's fine. <laughs> but I hope he comes soon. <laughs> it's fine. I'm not gonna rush you or anything. It's just, you know. It's taking a bit of a, a bit of a long time. 
Uh, I was just kidding. We're not going to go see Jill. We're going to go do side quests. Oh, is this in the room I'm not allowed to go in? Oh, sh oh wait. The side quest is in the infirmary. Okay, we'll do the other side quest first then. Because as soon as we walk in there, it's going to yeah. be a cutscene. What's everyone whispering about? And then we can pick up that other one. Doris. Do you have a moment, Sid? Which oh, team? People have gone Coles. missing. Coles they were sent team. to liberate a carriage of bearers liberate before they could carriage. begin moving in for their assault when the carriage was attacked by goblins. The goblins. curse breaker managed to release a stole us amid the confusion. They should okay. be back by now, but I, I can't help them. They know right. the work is dangerous. But what if I've got them all killed? I'd... Before they go out, I always remind them why we're doing this. We're freeing people. I never people. really thought yeah. how my words might affect them. What risks they might take because of the... Th yes, I will I'll go find, find them. them. Thank you. The plan was to intercept the slaver somewhere intercept in the dragon's the area. Slaver. That should be enough to go on. Okay. Today started off good. Security update got released for Cold War. Oh, really? That's good. Because, yeah, it's been in a pretty bad state for a long time. Do we need to go right there? Anna? <laughs> hey yeah. visions how are you my friend how have things been beat up slavers exactly free people and beat ass <laughs> mr popo thank you so much for the follow i'm so sorry about following the rest Obi it's gonna be on during the playthrough, but I normally never have it on, ever. I, I appreciate your understanding. We doing okay? Cole, I'm glad you're in one piece. You got engaged? Congrats! So, if you don't mind me asking, what are you doing here? Uh, Doris sent me to find you're you. You're missing? She hasn't heard anything since the attack. Congrats, Vision. She's been worried about you. I sent a runner to the dame in Northreach. The hideaway should have learned of our survival yesterday. Oh. Well, I'm here now. Free the bears? Only some. The rest locked themselves in the slaver's carriage rather than fleeing when they had the chance. Oh. I want to help them, Sid. But we're barely in any state to protect those few we did save. You made the right decision. Now where's the carriage? The goblins may still be out there. You have duties to attend to here. No, See to the injured. More than I'll handle goblins. the rest. All right, just follow the path to the south. And please, hurry. If the beastmen get to those bearers, the- I won't let that happen. Thank yeah, you. I'm not gonna let no, them get eaten just... alive, man. I'm not gonna let people get eaten alive unless they have already been eaten alive, you know? Hey, Gaming Ox, hey, JD. Finished your terrorizing with bomb pants. <laughs> yeah. They're trying to get into the carriage. Them some goblins, that's for sure. <laughs> Waken wind. But a da 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 Bing bang ball. Hold on. Use Titanic block to fend off ten enemy attacks. Ow, freaking smush me. I need 
needed that. I did not mean to press it twice, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> We love the game. People are playing so fast. What are y'all doing? Slow down. <laughs> Crystal's curse mission. I vaguely remember what that is, or I can guess what that is. I need to turn this off. Final Fantasy is incredible, Flame. Incredible. Incredible. Who are you? Rip me out of plastic. I've been acting brand new. A friend. Are there any more survivors? Why didn't you flee with the others? If the goblins had made it through that door, you wouldn't have stood a chance. Why should we run? One miserable death's no worse than another. Perhaps. But we're here to give you another choice. Freedom, safety, the life you've been denied. Come with us. Let us protect you. Sid, I, I couldn't just let you... You weren't too late then. Thank the gods. Gotta this fight, man risked his Malzino. life to Look. save yours. To give you a second chance. Fine. Do with us what you will. What we'll do with you is take you to safety. After that, it's up to you. Your lives are your own now. You can leave the rest to us, Sid. We'll get everyone back to the hideaway. Thank you. I'll let Doris know we're expecting new arrivals. Let's go, baby! The rebellion grows. May it prosper by the flames. I forgot that was a side quest. <laughs> it, I mean, it felt kind of like a main quest, you know? Going out, saving people, bringing them back to the hideaway. Pretty big deal. The little ones have been up to their old tricks again. Doris. Sid, welcome back. A stolas from the dame arrived not long after you left. If I'd just waited a little longer, I might have been able to deal with things myself. I don't know if you're ahead of me or, or behind me, Visions. I keep making the wrong not decisions. Sure. Cole and the others got home safely. You made exactly the right decision. No, I was lucky. Really, either way. I've been oh, you're way behind. For months, and then I said, Cole. Then I think I know. I after think them, I know. Fully what unprepared. Mean. What kind of leader sends people into danger? I should have urged greater caution, told Cole to be wary. We swore the same oath as you, Doris. We know what we're doing. It's good to see you safe and well, Cole. With all due respect, we curse breakers don't risk our lives because no one with exactly. doubts ever joins our ranks. The agony of removing the brand more than sees to that. Exactly. Exactly. We all know how much bravery that takes. Cole, I never doubted. Thank you. I sometimes wonder if I might prefer to risk death alongside the others, but I'm a curse breaker. I swore an oath too. You will. Yeah, I love all the characters killed. That's why I I hope they do end up doing more content for the game. Because I do love this the world building in this world and I love all of the characters. It's great. Breath of Fire, ra Rising Flames. I saw Sparty. I saw. The audio se seemed a bit weird on the, uh, on the Elden Ring thing, so I hope it's good. Oh, I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Your benefactors are a generous <laughs> lot. Safe passage. Not long ago, I was accosted by footpads as I walked the gilded path and would have perished alone in the desert had not the curse breakers come to me aid. I owe them my life. May this token serve them well. You Dire Wolf this. Jess. Best of luck out there, Sid. Dire Wolf Jess. Ha! Huh. 
A dire wolf subdues its prey by overwhelming it with a flurry of attacks that injure both body and spirit, stunning the creature and allowing for a quick kill. Increases combo damage. Huh. Increases combo damage. That seems pretty good. I'll equip it. I'll give it a little tinkle tinkle. I gave it a tinkle tinkle. Just overall combo increase. Ah, Clive. Talia. How's Jill? Recovering, but she still needs her rest. Hey, J Mojo. What's up? Take good care of her, won't you? There's a lot I'll of very sad stuff, visions. Oh, Gav was looking for you. He said he had something to show you in the shelves. J Mojo Cat. Oh, that's right. He went to ask Hippocrates about Togo. Right. He must have found something. Thank you for seven months, my friend. Welcome back. Welcome, welcome, welcome. You have the look of a man with the twins upon his shoulders, Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Talia has tasked me with removing a curse breaker's brand. It's your first time. I don't time. think I can do it. Oh, yeah, it's pretty. I'm afraid of what happens if I fail. You burn their face. Well, you yeah. survived, I know, but here as many die as recover. They die from Is having their brain Really removed? worth the risk. Ooh. You don't need me to answer that. You know full well what we're fighting for. I didn't know they were for. dying from having it removed. I hope as much as you that one day bearers can walk among others as equals. But until that day, a brand is a burden. And we must lift that burden. Hey, in order easy, to go greasy. undetected. How you doing, my friend? How the operation you? may be dangerous. But it's also essential. And we undergo it willingly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No. All you can do is your best. I still wish there was some other way. Makeup. But griping about my lot helps no one, I suppose. I know you will. Unfortunately, the first thing that he's doing is the preparation of a draft to dull the pain. Something I can't do with the infirmary's ammonia supply. So we need low. to go get some leaves. Well, that's go get Just some leaves. Just tell me what you need. You, you'll go. No of one knows course. Herblor like Taya. And she swears by ammonia for easing pain. Ermonia. Unfortunately for you, I do. Along the river near the village of Amber over in Rosaria. Just search. Bright blue blossoms. I pet Torgal pretty often. Yeah. Yeah, all of the playthroughs are up on YouTube as soon as we're done here. As soon as we're done, they are up there. Well, as soon as uh, YouTube processes them. Fly Ambrosia. The river was easy enough to find. Now for those herbs. Going the long way. Might have to kill some mother fudgers. Gonna have to kill some motherfuckers. All yours, Excuse you. Excuse. Excuse you. What are you doing? Excuse you. Do it again. Now, as I was doing, I was collecting some flowers. Oop. Hey, Rogue Hunter, how you doing? This is the only plant around here with blue flowers. I hope it's the right one. Yeah, how am I supposed to know it's the right one? The Warlock Raidathon is on there, yeah. 
It is indeed. Hopefully this will put Oh, we got new lore on the lore master? The hideaway's resident historian, after Sid's death and the destruction of his home, he joined Clive at the new hideaway, establishing a grand library within the walls of the fallen room from whence he continues to share his knowledge. He has taken the orphan twins, Tet and Crow, as his apprentices, though they have yet to prove the most attentive audience. Rodriguez They're mine. babies. Please. No one wants it. No one as a baby wants to become a lore master. They're like, yeah, 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 shut up. Books. Yeah, got it. Gonna be a busy work week. Oh man, good luck, Rogue. I know it's gonna be super the tiring. Have been up to their old tricks again. They were they were dinosaurs, Ed. They were they were dinosaurs. They're trying to eat me. I have more letters. Mm. I got new stuff at the forge too. The kids are hobbits. Yeah. I hope you didn't have to. Nope, it was fine. Here you go. Only the. When oh, I was yes. a baby, I wanted to be a lore this master. This is it. And more than I was expecting. I dare say the patient won't feel a thing. You'll do fine. Cool. Tie it. Thank you. Good luck. I'm sorry. The brand is more than just ink on flesh. It's a death sentence. Milk of the wyvern tail lurking just... Oh! Oh, that's why they call them wyvern! Oh, finally, an answer. <laughs> so at the beginning of the game, we were called Wyvern. I assume that this is why we are called Wyvern, because the ink is made from a Wyvern's tail. Low the surface well, now of the I know. One ill-conceived incision, a single slip, and the poison fouls the patient's blood. Failure means death. I assume they use that and for a success reason. Success means tremendous pain. Days of agony as the wound heals. I became a physicist to help people, not to kill them. I, I, I don't want to kill anyone. Curse breakers lead hard lives. And the operation is only the beginning. They toil in the shadows, risking life Petro, based and based on limb. how Mylan says he Knowing hates the lore, I don't them think neither so. glory nor acclaim. And yet we never won for volunteers. Why do you think that is? Conviction? The second They're time around is die. a lot of fun vision. They're willing to fight. To give their lives to create a world where people like us can be more than mere possessions. I know your mm -hmm. work isn't easy. But neither is going under the knife. Be a shoulder for your patients to lean on. Mm. <laughs> Stay strong for them. You sound like Tyre. It's natural. For a patient to feel like they're suffering in solitude. And it's a physicist's duty to see that they don't. Mm -hmm. Thank you for yeah. helping me remember that. Exactly. I exactly. won't falter. Exactly. Not again. Um, I would like to go on our way to check one yeah. if I have potions. Two, uh, what's new in the forge, and then we'll go head up to the lore master. Hey, Rainmaker, how's it going? Jill looked white as a sheet when they brought him. All right, what new things do you have for me? And what can I do for you? Um, Hunter's waist cloth, cloth. It's way worse than any of the she is I'm using. Way worse. Oh. You'll not find a better price than that. Back, are ya? I'm saying for you, dear. Oh, hey, a new sword, grindstone. Oh, right, this is the... This is the earth one. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. <laughs> And when he lifted his fists beneath them was found naught but dust. I, I can, um, I can match, matchy. Book of Barrows. It's like the Book of Sorrows. But no scratches, barrow. right? And? Oh, it looked pretty cool too. That's a pretty cool looking sword. I like that. It's nice. Mm 
All right, here we go. The lore Clive, on Torgal. Where have you been? Don't tell me. I've been wanting that to ask you something sense. about Torgal. Yeah. yeah. Where did you get him? Like, <laughs> in the first place? Uh, my father brought him back from one of his expeditions into the Northern Territories. They were crossing a snowfield when he heard his cries, wolf. and well, seeing no sign of his pack, they took him in. Northern wolf from the north. What do you reckon, Tomes? It certainly adds weight to the theory. Okay. Clive, I believe that Torgal may be no mere hound, but a rare frost wolf. An animal oh. native to the far northern reaches of Valisthea. In one of our oldest bestiaries, I found reference to a frost wolf who served as guardian to an ancient queen of the north. Such was his mastery over ether, he could cast magics on command. His name was Fenrir. Fenrir? Fenrir the Frost Wolf. Oh, well, god damn, Torgal. <laughs> now, the annals do not state it explicitly, but I have reason to believe this queen was a dominant of Shiva. Dream, thank you so much girl for from the Northern Territories I'm sorry about her followers only mode. One awakens as the dominant of Shiva, and the other... You're saying that Jill granted Toggle his powers. Oh. What? Yeah. Just like Fenrir. Yeah, yeah. People called him my hound, but Toggle and Jill were inseparable. They were, yeah. He grew up as a faithful companion to the dominant of Shiva, and years later, his powers awakened. Just when his master needed him the most. You're right. If it weren't for Toggle blasting those bastards to kingdom come, Jill would have been yeah, for it. Yeah, because we were always, like, Quite. on the field. Where she was but always Torgal's holding Torgal. power is his own. His latent birthright as a frost wolf. It had only to be unlocked. Oh, wow. Get you, Torgal. <laughs> <laughs> You're an even finer hound than we thought. <laughs> and regarding your original concern, you need not fear for Torgal's health. Oh, really? Why, the beast has the appetite of a behemoth. Just this very morn, I found him with his nose buried in my That nuts. doesn't actually quell my concerns. There you are! I've been looking everywhere for you. Bernard's here. I need you to introduce us so we can get to work. <sighs> I shall be a moment. Well, that is very good lore right there. Yeah. Torgal is a freaking frost wolf. Yeah, I'm very far ahead of you, Visions. You're probably going to hear some big spoilery stuff if you care about that. Here's the workshop, guys. Oh, snap. Yeah, Kildai, I love her. I love her so much. <gasps> it ain't brilliant. She has a cauldron. It is. Well, I couldn't have done it without you. You and everyone else. But I promise I'll pay you back. I'm gonna work my fingers to the bone for you lot. Starting right now. Just you wait. I'll make wonders like this world's never seen. She's totally gonna make us a blimp. Them. She's making us a blimp. <laughs> now that that's settled, I wonder if Vivian's made any progress tracking down Kupka. We have everything we need to begin work in earnest. And work in earnest, we shall! <laughs> oh, she's excited. Thanks for letting me do this, Clive. I'll pay you back, I promise. <sighs> nice. Oh, uh, when do we have a snooze for an ad? There's an ad in four minutes. Probably enough time for Vivian to do her thing. Oh, I have a snooze. Okay, cool. We can, we can keep it going for a bit. Before we get rudely interrupted. Nice visions, congrats. Okay, you're gonna see you're gonna see and hear a lot of spoilers, my friend. I hope you don't mind. How goes the hunt mind. for Kupka? Largely in circles. We have myriad sightings of strange soldiers in unexpected He's places. With Walu. But nothing definitive as yet. If only we knew for certain by what route he left Rosalith. Well keep at it. If anyone can piece this puzzle together, it's you. And I'm willing to wait as long as it takes.
<laughs> but we're all in on the lore, so. Yeah. Hey, take it easy. He has a cape. Yeah, got a cape and a hood. What? Here. Would that be a problem? <laughs> Do you know, Clive? I believe it a mercy that you didn't inherit your father's throne. Your poor people would surely live in fear of you. You have nothing to worry about on that front. No. I won't be claiming his crown. I'm a nice fella. <laughs> that is a relief. Uh, Clive, have you got a minute? We, um, have a guest. A guest? Who is it? Is it the Lord Commander? That would be strange. Why would it be the Lord Commander? Oh, it's me, Hello, Uncle! Trouble. It was a pleasure. Oh, no insight. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Byron? <laughs> Clive, my boy! Tub a cask and stoke the ovens for your favorite uncle is here! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's like, what the heck? <laughs> nice. Yay! Oh. Meanwhile, let's get some quick lore on the meanwhile. We are at the Crystalline Dominion. Uh, Mother Crystal located in the Crystalline Dominion. It is one of only five remaining in Valacia and is the largest of its kind. Silhouetted by the setting sun, the islands of Dominion spread out before it. The tale is truly a wonder to behold. Yay. The Dalmechian government sues for peace. How shall we respond? This is where our mom is now. If they're willing to accept their fault in the matter, I see no reason to refuse them. Still, we must insist on substantial reparations. The twin side stores are not as bottomless as reported. Aye, and we have many more mouths to feed. We shall just have to have the Dalmex empty their treasuries for us. Of course, none of this would have been possible without your timely intervention, Prince Olivier. Indeed, I doubt any of us would have had the courage to trade words with the mighty Titan, nor less the wit to win him over. The Empire owes you a great debt. May the blessing of the crystals go with you. Eh. Twin side. The former capital of the Crystalline Dominion after the unilateral maneuver by the Holy Empire of Sambreca became the Imperial Capital. The Five Cardinals, the senior statesmen that make up the highest office of government in Sambrec, after the Emperor himself, the Council of Elders. The Council is comprised of the High Cardinal, representative of Central Sambrec, and the Holy Capital, Oriflam, and the four Cardinals who administer the Outer Provinces, the North, South, East, and West. May the blessing of the crystals go with you. What did, what did he do with the sun? Very good. He said, screw you, Titan, dumb whore. Is that what he said? Now, let us come to the question of precisely when the Dalmex will withdraw their troops. Dion's fire could rid us of them in mere moments. The so men of the fist will Dion. not withdraw until a peace he treaty is concluded. So let us keep the negotiations open, give them time to gather what gold and trinkets they can, and once they deliver that which we demand, what worth is a piece of parchment? <sighs> Your Radiance, were Prince Dion to take the field, the enemy would surely send their own dominant to meet him. Yes. And while His Highness would of course prevail, there would be heavy losses on both. You need not fear Hugo Kupka. He is engaged on the Western Front. Even were the Dalmex to send for him, he would not arrive in time. 
As much as I would enjoy witnessing a clash between Bahamut and Titan, it is not to be. Okay. Everyone's just like... And what of your subjects, your radiance? Yeah, you think about them people, those guys? Yeah. If the fighting spread to the city proper, the people would bear the brunt of it. There will be losses, it is true. Yet for every citizen who falls, another can be bred. Bread? For every home that burns, another can be built. The Empire will live on. Dion? I guess they deserve yes, each other, sir. but Dion doesn't deserve any of this. It's glass half full. Yeah, what is with the stupid flower thing? What do we do with the dumb flower? He twizzles it around and then puts it back on the platter. Is it a drug? Are we huffing drugs? Is this drug use? <laughs> yeah, Dion has no one. At least we had our dad who was like very, a very nice person and was nice to us. I mean, it's pretty, you know? Prepare for battle. But, sire... Do not make me repeat myself. Return to your camp and await my orders. Yeah, it's the symbol. Yeah, I just, I just find it... your wish. I find it weird that he's like twiddling a flower and then puts it on a planter. I should depart at once. Do they have lore on the flower? They probably do right now, right? Yep. Why Oh! Oh, the poisonous flower that makes the mark. Oh, the tattoo tail. The tattoo flower tail. Visions, you got it, bud. I believe in you. The elegant white flower that is a symbol of the holy empire of some breath. I mean, I assume, right? Because they mentioned wyvern tail. Poison. Uh, tattoos. Oh my god. Oh my god. May Gregor forgive you. A lot of innocent people are about to die. What do the astrologers augur? The stars are in agreement, your radiance. The shadow of treachery hangs over Prince Dion. So Annabella's tales were true. You disappoint me, Dion. Maybe it's because you're a dumb bitch. And he doesn't want to be a dumb bitch. You ever think about that? Ever think about the beat a dumb bitch makes your kids want to stop you from doing those things? What on earth is Uncle Byron doing here? Mm -hmm. Only one way to find it. out. You know? Oh, there's an ad starting in two seconds. Bye bye. <laughs> hey, good timing. <laughs> good timing. Good timing. I will go read my letter in the meantime. I don't get why Joshua didn't the find Clive sooner. Just one thing after I another mean, around here. Those are the mysteries, man. You gotta read the lore and figure Lids it out. Into the storeroom. It's all right. See, there's nothing. Go read some letters. Homecoming. I apologize for what happened at Rosalith. I fear that might have been that might have been had not you, Gavin Torgal, fought so fiercely. Once again, you were there when I needed you most, and for that, I shall be forever grateful. Seeing the city I had once come to know as my home reduced to flame and rubble has left me with much sadness in my heart. But the time for looking back is beyond us. We must focus on the here and now. Our memories will be waiting for us when this is all through. Jill. The 
These are me memories. The oath. Hey, Tragic, how you doing? Where's this thing? Oh, right, I just got, I just got my own little balcony. <laughs> right, I remember. I picked up the loot there before. We have an ad for two more minutes, and then we're gonna hit up Yayo main story. I won't go down here just yet because it might trigger like right away. Sometimes it triggers when you like walk near them. Sometimes it triggers when you talk to them. So I don't want to risk it and have you guys miss anything. Uh, I guess I could go refill me water so I can be full on water. I'll be right back. I might sit down too. I've been standing since the podcast and me legs hurt a little bit. Dun, da, da, dun, dun. Dusk is going down. Joshua has been on his own mission. He knows stuff that we that we have no idea about. Here we go. Ah, my dear nephew. How <laughs> I've missed you. <laughs> how did you find this place, Uncle? Through the good offices of young Sir Wade. He really is the most helpful fellow. That does make sense. As are you, I hear. The Guardians and those they freed tell the most outlandish tales of your heroics in Rosalith. Which is why I came, to learn the full truth of the matter. Sort the fact from the fiction, so to speak. You were working with the Guardians of the Flame to evacuate the people of Rosalith to Port Isolde. I was, aye. Then I have questions for you. Please, come inside, Uncle. Gladly. Let's get him hooked uh, up with the, the tomes and the lore table. State of the realm. There are 2,000 gold talents in those chests. See that they're added to my nephew's coffers, would you? <laughs> 2,000? <laughs> See, I don't even know what that means, but I assume it's a lot. <laughs> and I'm afraid that oh, is all I know. A fleet sailing south past Port Isolde. Most intriguing. Show us the map, Vivian. Let's go. Forgive me for not being able to tell you more. I hadn't the faintest I idea Coco withdrew wounded from Rosalith. 
Still less that my own Isn't nephew dealt the decisive blow. What do you think, Vivian? I think, with this news of the Dalmechian fleet and recent reports of the Royalists' movements, that the final piece of the puzzle has fallen into place. Come here and I'll show you. Yeah, it's map time. Dude, I love map time. Map time gets me so excited. <laughs> I love map time. <laughs> I love it. Okay. It is known that Kupka's forces entered Rosaria via its unguarded coast. Mm -hmm. So can the same be said of your visitors from Wulud? Certainly, Maybe. her royal navy is famed for the efficiency with which it bears her knights from one battlefield to the next. And in the Ein Heyar, or Black Galleon, she boasts a vessel nigh as swift, and every bit as feared as the kingdom's legendary cavalry. The Dora Mansa. A fitting flagship for a land apart, her naval presence being crucial to her ambitions beyond Ash. Yes. It seems safe to assume that the Royalists did indeed enter Rosaria from the sea. Man, they took a long route. God damn. Okay, we have the Iron... Uh, I heard... I heard... Yar, I heard it a bit. The flagship of the Waluder Navy, also known as the Black Galleon. Alongside in the... I need to sneeze. Alongside the Royal Cavalry, it is the pride of Walud and is capable of swiftly delivering elite troops onto enemy soil to make war in the name of the mighty Odin. The Royal Knights of Walud. Had to lay on the floor with your dog? That's a great thing to do. You should always do that. The Kingdom of Walud's main battlefield forces, also known as the Kingsguard, while they ultimately answer to King Barnabas, the Knights' orders are usually issued by their Lord Commander. Mm, that fella. I know that fella. The Royal Intelligencers, a special unit led by Benedicta Harmon, dominant of Garuda, are a notable exception to this rule, reporting as they do directly to the king. Okay. Yeah, I didn't end up seeing So then, had you a vested interest in Titan's survival, whither would you take him? Why home to Drake's Fang, a place rich enough in ether to conjure the magics needed to mend his hurts. But would that not entail an arduous voyage around the Southern Cape? Let us say that the Royalists did put ashore with a mind to spirit Kupka away from under your very nose. Mm -hmm. Could that they truly did. have been their plan for him? To load him aboard one of the ships flying Republican colors sighted off the coast near Port Isolde. Mm, to spend Republican. weeks at sea, being tossed hither and yon by unforgiving waves his life hanging in the balance. Yeah, it seems, doesn't no. seem like a good idea. The journey would mean Titan's death, and Kupka's faithful creatures would not allow it. So what then was the plan of our Waluda friends? Reports suggest they made not for the coast, but for the desert. The and by cutting through the Velcroy, a party traveling light would have Titan back in his bed days before a galley could lurch into port. Ah. To wit, it was the Royalists, not the Republicans, who effected Hugo Kupka's safe retreat. Yes. I yeah, would yeah. stake your life on it. Yeah, I know this. I know that already. I, know. I pay attention. <laughs> Correct, Visions. So it was yep. the Waluders who spirited the wretch away. I could have told you that 20 now minutes I think ago. About it. Well, actually, there was something yesterday. a little strange about the ships I saw. <laughs> I yesterday. The men seemed almost crestfallen, as if in mourning. mourning. As if they believed, or were made to believe, that their master was dead. <laughs> you have a keen mind, Lord Rosfield. Mm. And you have your answer. To find Kupka, you have merely to follow the royal <laughs> trail across the Velcro. Very smart. It may well <laughs> Do we have extra lore? We have extra lore on Vivian. A scholar and strategist who makes her home in the hideaway, analyzing every shred of information that comes in from the wider world in order to divine the dispositions of the realm's armies and those who lead them. She offers her insight to Clive that he might better understand the lay of the land. The moniker Nine Tales, of which she herself is fond, was gifted her by fellow scholars in recognition of her ability to speak at length on almost any subject. She's a smart gone lady. cold by now. But as they say in the Republic... All roads lead to Drake's Fang. Mm. Uh, allow me to accompany you part of the way. 
As luck would have yeah. it, I had intended to journey Candleward on business after visiting you here. The Fang would be but a short detour. I don't I'd know if you want to travel with me, bro. Give I don't a know if it's a good idea. Ready. I need to tell my friends what we've learned. That's a good idea. And where we're going. People don't like very me well, very but much. Be quick about it, my boy. Time waits for no man. I just don't know if that's smart. I don't know if that's a good idea. The little subtleties on the characters' faces of just like being happy that here for another of my lectures. He's around, you know. Allow me like. to educate you. Okay, one the must situation understand one's place map. in the world. Okay, so we are going to Drake's Frang. Uh, this is the Free Cities of Canver, which is where we. Wait, I haven't read this before. I don't think. Or maybe I have. I don't remember. A federation of neighboring independent city states located to the southeast of the Dalmachian Republic, where originally part of Dalmachia, the cities achieved their independence in the year 857, hoping to step away from the Republic's internal struggles and focus instead on the commerce upon which their poster has prosperity. <laughs> prosperity had been built. Political power currently resides with a council of guildmasters, prominent Canverian traders and craftspeople. The lack of a dominant or a mother crystal to covet, along with its considerable financial resources, allows Canva to retain both its independence and neutrality in the face of considerable turmoil elsewhere as such it lacks a standing army the defense of its walls haven't been relegated to a small yet well-trained city guard okay so the dalmachian republic are going to the, the yeah this place and so is the imperial army and then we assume that they went from rosalith to here that's our assumption Here's the latest information I have. What's changed since last time? Oh, we have Sid's daughter in here. Uh, we've got more connections with this. Yep. Mother is involved in affairs of the Imperial Court since he was a small child. Yep. Odin, Lord Commander. All right. The I'm state up to of date. the realm is ever got changing. It. Got it. Understood. Clive. Mid's finished outfit in her little workshop, I. I'm Otter. on the case. Kupka's at Drake's Fang. I'll be leaving before sunset. You're not going in there alone, are you? Don't worry. I've got Byron. I'm not going there to destroy the Mother Crystal. All I'm after is Kupka's head. I won't risk any more than I have to. I promise. The Lanza and the Fang are all Kupka's personal fiefdom. You have any trouble on the way? You ask for Rosina Dalamil. Some Dalla. call her the Desert Hare. Desert. Who is she? An old associate of Sid's. And only Sid's. Mm. All I know is the name. And that they used to meet at the Dalamil Inn. We've heard nothing from her since he died. But I'm thinking maybe the new Sid might be able to bring her back into the fold. Okay. Thanks. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. You got jump scared? <laughs> so, uh, what about your uncle? I, I mean, he's welcome to stay, but... Don't look so worried. <laughs> He'll be coming with me. Thank fuck for that. <laughs> Gav, Otto, What's I'm wrong leaving with you my two uncle? in charge. You can count on us. He's a mate. He's a great. Is that his Batman voice? That's probably just his voice. A lot of these people are like, this is just their voices. <laughs> All right, Uncle. I'm ready to depart. Shall we? We shall. Come, let us away to adventure. Let's go. Damn snow. Holy crap. That was fast. You guys are so fast. I'm glad you are still saying it's fantastic. Thank you. Oh, the Velcroy Desert, a vast arid sea of sand and stone that is slowly consuming Western Dalmechia since time immemorial. 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 Ooh. Lore time. Never mind.
Don't say any spoilers. I will ban you until the playthrough is over. <laughs> There's an old trading post not far from here. The road to Drake's Fang leads through it. The trading post it is. <laughs> that's see, that's already a spoiler. That's already a spoiler, Forgato. That's already a spoiler. Yeah, the music's awesome. Ooh, Our ooh, destination ooh, lies ooh. over that dune beyond the ruins. Mark them well, Clive. How do you feel? It's too easy to lose one's bearings. How do you feel about fighting some scarabians? Over here! This one. You're finished. Look at him with his little axe. Look at him with his little axe. A hell diver. Many years ago, when you were just a boy, you and I rode this way. Did we? I don't remember Come that. your father on a scouting expedition to Drake's Fang. He let me come with you. Oh. I'm not surprised you don't remember. It was just before Wait, Joshua wait, wait jump, grab, jump, you grab, so jump, grab. Hi, yeah. You whipped your chocobo too hard on the journey home and fell from the saddle. <laughs> oh, I shall never forget how Elwyn fussed over you as you sat in the sand, bawling like a babe. <laughs> Balling like a baby. Hey, JSK, what's up? How's your day going? Lots of chocolates. I can't bring out. Oh, I can't. Okay. Not the same. Yeah! See you later, Visions. Enjoy the rest of the game. Hmm, traitors. Play it non-stop. Yeah, you're all gonna finish before me. It's crazy. You guys are mad lads. Absolute mad lads. Who do you think those soldiers were? Oh, damn, Sparty. Jesus. This is cool. Seeing people make their trade routes and stuff. That's awesome. Ah, there she is. The good old Dalamil Inn. Wow. Do you know, this heat has given me quite a thirst. Uh, quick drink before we press on. Wow, this is nice. Very nice. Yeah, people approach combat all totally differently from one another. I've only really watched Tomo play, and he plays super different to me. Uh -oh. Look there. Those mm -hmm. are Ashen Steeds. No doubt about it. Ashen and such a long ride from Stone here. Our Luda friends must be soothing their saddle sores in the inn. Shall we join them? <laughs> Byron wants to pick a fight in a, in a, in a tavern. Run along and play now, Torgal. Dogs aren't allowed inside. I don't want to leave him outside. Don't leave, Torgal! <laughs> Ah, yes, the hoods. The hoods will protect us. True. They have no idea. Any new lower? They eat.
a literal oasis in the Velcroy, a desert in the western part of Dalmechia. Dalamil offers goods, food, and respite for those travelers who endure the long march through sweltering sands. In particular, the hot spring baths fed from nearby waters will not only ease the pains of the road, but are also rumored to cure all manner of ills, from boils and boobos <laughs> to various afflictions in the groin many of which are like to be contracted at one of Dalamil's many brothels. Lovely. I love sharing water with, uh, <laughs> with groin issues, people with groin problems from all the brothels. That's my favorite. Oh, hot springs are said to cure a lot of things in the real world, so. Good day to you. Eating? <laughs> Sorry about my pal. He only talks when his mouth's full. <laughs> what do you recommend? Well, if you're after something light, we do a fine chocobo soup with lentils and honey. None. Two bowls of that, then. Oh, God Inhale. damn it. Right you are. Hey, I don't want to eat a chocobo. Coming. Your pal? Would you rather be my squire? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they eat chocobos. Hey, George. They eat them, they ride them. I mean, a lot of places eat horses. So, does it make sense? Oh, that's Joshua's companion. Grace, it is plain you are not yet well enough to travel. If you would only let me take you to someone who can better attend to your ills. No, we must press on. Prince Dion has returned to his camp and will soon depart for the front. I must speak with him at all costs. <laughs> Miss this chance and I may never get another. That's true, you know, that's true. That's true. You do understand that. I'll give him that. Yes, your grace. You must at least agree to take your medicine. I'll fetch you some water. Ooh. Not good. Not great. Jill's also coughing up blood. This song is always stuck in my head. Being a dominant makes you sick. <laughs> Keep watch, they tell us. But all I see is sand. I hear they got our guest back to the Fang without any trouble. Right, we'll Cal? That's what I enough. thought, too. Why I was the like, Lord Commander oh, dragged us all this way just to save that blockhead skin. We'll never know. Dominant or not, he's a bloody idiot. He is a bloody idiot. That'll be Cooker, then. <laughs> well, let's get this down us. We have a long way to go. Hey, you. Fancy accent you got there, fella. Are you some kind of royalty? <laughs> Uncle? Sorry. man the rock guy then right that rock man that's that can guy. you walk your grace what's wrong 
I fear trouble may be brewing downstairs. Trouble do be brewing. You two are travelers, are you not? <laughs> Me and my companions are strangers here. Perhaps you'd be good enough to accompany us a while. Come on, help us find our way. Sorry, lads. But we've got business in camera that can't wait. Ah, I'm sure you could spare us an hour or two. Come on, come on. Come on. Friend. to lose his friend oh. Oh. stay back uncle Three. gladly yeah just go eat your food sir go sit down and <laughs> grab a snack oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's the outlaw take him <laughs> try it <laughs> <laughs> Bravo, my boy! Just like that! Guys don't even put up a fight, man. You could at least try. Is it bad if I take a break from this season of D2? No. Just play whatever you want to play, man. If you don't want to play it, don't play it. I don't feel like you would fall behind. They didn't even have like a power increase this season, so... I think you can kind of chill. Put the damage on their tab? They should. They picked the fight with me. <sighs> For your trouble. <laughs> or Byron will do it. Byron will pay for it. What advice, <laughs> miss? That soup could do with a touch more salt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, thanks. Byron's hilarious. <sighs> Going out the window. Ooh, look at that water. Ooh. Now's our chance. Yeah. That looks good. Your grace? I'm fine. Yeah. Kinda does have a god sealed away in his body. I just let him out, you know, it's fine. <laughs> he does. I I appreciate the light in the dark, man. The world is very dark. Very, very dark. Do we have any extra lore? No. Man, they destroyed everything. Ooh. Joshua. Clive? They probably slipped away, or we're not gonna be able to catch them. Mm, he left his carrots because he hates carrots. What is it now? Oh. 
It, it's, it's a nice little confirmation for him. Nice little confirmation. Not a fan of carrots, really. I love carrots. Full circle lore, exactly. Yeah, they do it really well, Cal. All of the little subtleties on people's well, faces and everything. we didn't know where to find Kupka before. We do now. The Royalists said it themselves. Their guest is in the Fang. We should press on before any more of their friends turn up. What y'all got going on in here? Absolutely no nothing. It's nice. It's very nice. Oh, excuse me. Are they motion captured? I think so. I think they are. Ah, they've closed the road. And it's the only way from here to the Fang. Looks like it we gotta seem kill. Lord Kupka Ooh. is not accepting Excuse visitors at present. I don't even feel We have to get through that gate. Uh, not by force, <laughs> I trust. We've attracted quite enough unwanted attention already. Burn the world, By guile, then. Perhaps the desert hare can offer us her aid. Mm. Rosina Dalamil, woman of mystery. Rosina but how will Dalamil. we find her? We know naught of her but her name. We just go. Unless she was working with Sid. Lady Sid's other collaborators have all been people of means, the wealthiest and most successful members of their communities. She's I'll probably a this dame. Rosina Dalamil is the same. Probably a dame. That would certainly help to narrow the search. We need only inquire as to who is in charge of the town. And that's exactly what I mean to do. Let's do it. Who's the big boy in charge around here? Looks oh. like we won't be getting back to Drake's fan anytime soon. Anything I can interest you in? What you got? Breath of lightning. Ooh, I don't use lightning. It does have a new song though. Do Go like, with Gilbert. I do like songs. Oh, gonna speak with someone over here. Light it oh, for first thing. Okay, what you got? Anything I can help you with, travelers? Information. Allow me. My good man, we represent one of the oldest and greatest trading houses of Port Isolde. We're seeking to expand our business in the region and would very much like to make the acquaintance of Dalamil's leading entrepreneurs. <laughs> if only we knew where to find them. Hmm. Hmm. Well, he does look we're fancy. best known for our baths, our markets, and our smithies. I suppose you could do worse than start your search at one of those. She's a Thank you. housekeeper. You've been most helpful. Oh, um... You wouldn't happen to know a lady by the name of Rosina Dalamil, would you? No. I can't say I do. Well, I feel like they wouldn't tell us the anyway. Let's get that feeling, you know? She's a secret lady. What do you want? Can't you oh, see I'm busy? she's got nice eyes. I won't keep you long. I'm looking for someone. A woman by the name of Rosina Dalamil. Do you know her? Never heard of her. Is that all? Mm. One more question. Mm. If I wanted to find the richest trader in town, where would you recommend that I look? Well, that's easy. The Briar's Kiss. Briar's at it again! This side of the strait. Gerner's only a young sprig, but he's got all the right ideas. The Briar, man. The Briar's Kiss, you say? Thank you. Briar's Kiss? I doubt this young sprig is the person we're looking for. You said Sid's contact was likely to be an influential sort. Influence comes with age and experience. Believe you me. Or being really goddamn looks like good we'll at be things. Getting back to Drake's oh, she looks important. Mummy, <laughs> I want to play with the crystal. How many times do I have to tell you? Briar's in every game. 
Uh, every game. Can this I help you? Beautiful. Yes, I'm looking for a woman by the name of yeah. Lucina Dalamil. <laughs> a long-standing pillar of your community, I believe, from old trading stock. Then you should ask Ferda. Ferda. He's been here for years. Knows the place and its people like the back of his hand. And he's in with all the old merchant families. Try the baths. That's where you'll usually I find I knew him. we needed to go to the Thank bathhouse. Thank you kindly. When I need to ask someone something, I'll go, Yes, kind well, sir. It sounds like we have our man. Perhaps. <laughs> Let's go and find out exactly what this I am from a very knows. wealthy part of town, and I'm wondering I'm where to find the best door. traders. Fair enough. Excuse me. Are you further? I am. Can I help you, travelers? Yes, sir. I hope so. You've lived here for some time, is that correct? Do you know Rosina Dalamil? We believe she may be a trader of some renown. And what business do you have with the desert hare? She was a close friend here. of mine. I was hoping she might be able to help me. Very well. Go to the bordello. I'll arrange an introduction. Okay. The bordello. Just look at the deal. Do you think we can trust him? I don't think Only I can trust anybody, man. I don't trust a single goddamn person. So you're the ones who've been sniffing around. I beg your pardon? Don't play the fool. Stick your nose in our business and you're likely to lose it. What's these guys' problem? Ah, oh, what the heck? Oh, I'm not on the train. Stay down! Ooh, I got gotcha, you, fellas. Over here. Yeah, let's go, Torgal. <laughs> Yeah, Torgal popping off. Bing bong. I can't do any. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. And a ball. And a bing. And a thing. <laughs> yeah, word spread very fast. I don't even know who these fellas are. I got no beef with these guys. I don't know them. At least we didn't kill them, looks like. Just, you know, a little bit injured. Who are you working for? Him or her? Uh, uh, he, him. The, the boss. He wanted us to test you. Though one could hardly call that a test. Lord Ferda? <laughs> Look what the cat dragged in. Your skill with a blade is rare indeed, my lord. A fitting talent for an outlaw. Hey, they you know. know who I am. Do we got lore on Ferda? No, just sit down. So what now? Call in the men of the rock and collect the bounty? That isn't my decision to make. Our work is done. Take him to meet to see his our precious skills. Rosina. I wanted she to see our skills. She will be interested to make his acquaintance. To confirm who uh, we are. Yes, my lord. To the lock of leisure, then. The lock of leisure. To the lock of leisure. The lock of leisure. Maybe they've got lore on the veil. Plates and pots! Bowls and bases! Fresh bread, warm from the oven. Once you go flat. <laughs> yeah, have a taste. <laughs> the most fragrant herbs and The spices. finest fabric! Is this the place? Who was Forge? 
The Briar's Kiss. The Briar's Kiss. Ah, so it was the young sprig after all. So much for Rosina Dalamil being a woman of experience. How wrong She's I was. She's actually just a magic rabbit. It was an easy mistake Not to make, person, Uncle. Though. After all, it must have been years since Sid last saw her. Sorry, him. Whoever this Lubor truly is, he's clearly a man of means. I'd say he deserves our respect. Briar's Kiss is deadly. <laughs> See that he gets it. Got some fine looking weapons over there, if I do say so myself. Lubor, Lord Ferda told me to bring them to you. My boys tell me you're in need of assistance. Sid the Second. What a cool intro to a character. <laughs> that was cool. Forge Master of the Briar's Kiss, the finest smithy in DeMille. Lubor is also the Desert Hare. An ally of Sid's who went by the name Rosina. Rosina Dalamil. <laughs> I won't waste your time. I need passage through the South Gate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Uh, yeah, I'm being serious. Tell me, what do you think is a merchant's most important commodity? Trust. I trust. Everyone I knew knows it. that. <laughs> Without it, you have nothing. I told you. <laughs> and nothing is exactly what you have. And so, for you, I too have nothing. I'm not in the business of helping every lost puppy that wanders in off the street. You literally called me Sid the Second. I'm a busy man, as you can see. You called me Sid the Second. That doesn't that mean anything to you? Let's leave this mama to his farce. By all means, find someone else to help you on your way. Just be sure to tell them you're not the two travelers from the inn the guards are looking for. Don't want them jumping to conclusions, do we? Why, you... So, I don't know how to feel about this guy right now. What do you need right to do to earn your trust? I like this one. Willing to do whatever it takes to get what he wants. He's gonna want. <laughs> Men like you time? <laughs> have a special place in my heart. Mm, maybe. Why, you ask? Because they get me what I want. Always. You want me to go beat up some mother fudgers and get you the goods? I can do that. Fine. So what do you want? Do Don't that. tell me you're going to listen to this swaggering scruff. Swaggering We might as well scruff. hear him out. It's only natural that an ally of Sid's would seek assurances of strangers. Assuming he is an ally, of course. Five years ago, he would have still been a boy. And yet, even then, I had more good sense than a man, oh, five times my age? But enough of the pleasantries. We seems were speaking rude. of what I want. <laughs> he seems kind of rude. I want you to put an end to the trouble in Dalamil. Oh, just a small feat. Return to me when you have done so, and you shall have my aid. It's a bit vague, Until don't then, you think? I bid you good day. Yeah, it's a little bit what vague. What trouble? If you're going to <laughs> give us orders, be clear about them, damn you. Manners, Greybeard. One catches more damselflies with honey than with vinegar. What did you call me? My apologies. A word of advice in recompense. Follow the crystals. Oh, but that was three. Oh, I'm making this too easy for you. Follow the crystals. Ha! It will be easy. Solving his little riddle should be like dealing with him. Child's play. <laughs> Let us divide our forces, Clive. I'd rather not drag this parlor game on any longer than we need to. <sighs> All right. Good luck, Uncle. Yeah, you you have fun with that. Yeah, good luck, Byron. Good I luck. I thought we were the only ones causing trouble in Delamil. Oh, oh what's that? For the best drop in Dalamo, we'll visit the final sting. All right. Noted. Aha! 
Excuse me. Is it true there's been trouble with crystals of late? You've heard, then? Y I've yeah. Heard Damn thieves. Thieves. Pilfering the crystals that were meant to fill our cups and light our stoves. Thieves. Us common folk have hardly had a shard to share between us these last few moons. And it isn't as if we can buy them on the black market, either. Whoever's taking them, they aren't sharing. I like the music here. It's nice. Real nice. So they, uh, there's thieves taking crystals so they can't do all of their daily thing. Do you have a moment? Oh my god, Dino, really? It what for. Holy Just crap. Just a question. Dalamil seems to be thriving compared to the other villages I came through on the way. Is there a reason for that? The war well, down. we're a stone's throw from Drake's Fang for one. Oh. The soldiers guarding the mother crystal and the shipments need a place to spend their hard-earned gill. The men Is of the rock true? throw their money about like there's no tomorrow. Men of the rock. Is that so? <laughs> well, thank you. Don't let me keep you from your work any longer. Every time you came in, you're in the exact. I was in the exact same place. <laughs> oh man, I'm so slow, dude. I'm so slow. I'm luring it up. I'm just trying to counter it's everything. Gave me to a silken it's softness, like eating a cloud. You wouldn't believe how much he gave me. Ooh, what can I do for you, soldier? The, uh, Need that point. sword polishing. I'm not a soldier. I don't oh, think she means my sword. You. I serve the men of the rock and the men of the rock only. I don't think she means you sword. Have oh, my back. An agreement with them? I think she means a different don't sword. Be stupid. I just know which side my bread is buttered. Don't want to be stuck under some pauper when they come knocking. Mm -hmm. With pockets deeper than Zemeckis and an urge to empty them. Yeah, she ain't talking just about Just leave, those will you? Before you scare them off. I think I'm starting to get an idea of what's been going on. I wonder if Uncle Byron's learned anything of use. I'm gonna say no. Back at the inn by now. I'm gonna say he's Fresh probably bread. learned from nothing. Wait, I saw that I could pet you. Yeah, you're gonna have to, uh... Did I break the game? Can you move out of the way so I can pet my puppy dog? <laughs> look, look at his face! He's like... Take a sniff, good sir. The finest fabrics. What was all that crashing and banging? Is he visiting a lady? You know, it's probably you, the one who broke all our furniture. I didn't even pick a fight. It's what not my fault. What do you want? Haven't you caused enough trouble already? I'm looking for my pal. Have you seen him? The gentleman who was with you? Yes, he's upstairs, but... But... He's naked? Thank you. I'll go and fetch him. He's gotta be naked, right? He's gotta be butt-ass naked. What's he doing? <laughs> Where are you at, sir? Let me treat you. Oh, is this I'm pretty flush these days. How are you now? Ew. Huh. Oh, he's not naked. Okay, fantastic. Byron. Will this suffice as a deposit? By the sense. That's a black pearl. What are you doing? One <laughs> of the many treasures in my collection that I would be only too happy to part with, should you give me reason to do so. All right. I'm sure that we can come to an agreement, but not here. He wants to get you naked, buyer. Don't fall for it. What are you doing, uncle? He's being worse. It would. This is the uncle you don't take anyone with you, man. Anywhere with you. You don't take him anywhere. They're going to do embarrassing things. Embarrassing, terrible things. <laughs> this is by far the most naked Final Fantasy. <laughs> I thought he'd either be with a lady or he'd be in a bath. Care to explain why you're giving gifts to Kupka's men? Bait, my boy. One cannot catch one's prey without it. We're and I do baited. believe I've snagged us quite the quarry. I started by asking around the markets as to where I might purchase crystals. Mm -hmm. I had no luck, of course, 
It's forbidden to trade in such things. Forbidden. But my uncharacteristic indiscretion just happened to attract the attention of those uniformed ruffians. R ruffians. They took me aside and said they could procure the crystal I sought if I proved I could pay of for it. Of course. The so the pearl was your proof. <laughs> I thought they'd ask for more. A second-rate specimen like that would only fetch 500,000 or so. A small price to pay for admittance to the underworld. <laughs> but enough about my little I mean, act obviously of he's subterfuge. A lord. What did you discover? That, that the supply thieves. of crystals has dried up of late. And some people seem to think they're being stolen. Meanwhile, members of Kupka's private guard have been spending money all over town. Mm -hmm. I'll wager those soldiers you've been talking to have been siphoning off crystals meant for elsewhere and pocketing the profits. I'll wager you're right. Yep. We'll meet with the yep. men, just as you arranged. Yeah, and half put an end to the trouble Lubor spoke of. I could buy so many ah, records that for that. Preening Poppinjay thought this would be difficult. Preening Poppinjay. It just goes to show one should never underestimate a Rosfield. We'll soon wipe that smirk off his face. <laughs> like sitting there, I like to meet starting the to think this was a, a bad idea to bring my uncle. Far from prying eyes. The perfect place for a spot of double dealing. Double I trust dealing. I can count on your support if things turn sour. I mean, obviously. Of course. I'm not just going to let you die, am I? Genuine cactar needles imported from across the sea. Just one prick and your little sparrow will sing. Are we... Are we pricking our penises with cactar needles? That's how we get Fucking it up if we have wrong. problems getting it up. I hope so. <laughs> well, alrighty. Okay, I mean, hey, whatever works, I guess. Ooh, can I talk to it? This river runs all the way to the southern seas. They used to load the crystal onto barges and sail it to the villages downstream. Before the canyons were lost to beasts and bandits, <laughs> when I was a girl, Wait. I would wave to the boatmen as they set off on their long Actual journey. Actual donuts. <laughs> and they would throw me sweetmeats in return. I'm starting to think that everything has a seedy underbelly to it, you know? Oh, I gotta go all the way over there? Oh, well, goddamn. I'm just gonna fast travel over here, then. I mean, yeah, it's the, the, make your little sparrow sing. I mean, what else Why could that possibly mean? And clearly, any any of these like little cities that have a brothel, they're a big part of the little the little towns. Big part. Okay, let's go. Faster. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, I thought that tree was like a big enemy, and I was like, oh, who's that? I want to go fight him. Wait, why is Lord Byron so goddamn fast? What are you doing? It's freaking speedy. Bye -bye -bye. I feel like I'm playing Aladdin. Man, I love the Aladdin game. Those games were so hard, though, man. So difficult. Okay. Do we have any new lore? New lore, new lore. Nope. No new lore. I'll take it from here. What's he gonna do? Oh, right. He's, he's bargaining. I'm like, what do you mean? What are you gonna do? <laughs> You're not gonna do anything. Wow, I never thought we'd be using cactar needles to get get it up for Ladies of the Night in Final Fantasy. Never thought I'd see the day. I was beginning to think you weren't coming, my lord. You've brought your contribution? All the silver and stones I could scrape together at such short notice? You brought the whole 500 talents. 
That was the price we agreed upon, yes? If you've no objections, I'd like to see the crystal. Mm -hmm. Of course. Right this way, my lord. It does look pretty important. Look at all the details on his coat. That's a lot of crystals. That is a lot of crystals. Not bad at all. You weren't lying about the clarity. But what of security? If I were to be stopped on the road, what guarantee have I that it wouldn't be seized as property of the Republic? Because these crystals are no longer the property of the Republic. You're not buying from us. You're buying from them. Oh. And we have no more jurisdiction here than you, my lord. A black shield. But we have ships. Right? And we'll gladly deliver to a port of your choosing now that our price has been met. Royalists, eh? Royalists. What brings you here? They definitely Why, know to collect their share of Drake's Fang's blessing, of course. Our nations are allies, and so they are entitled to a portion of the Mother Crystal's bounty. And okay. being such good friends, we elected to increase that portion. And the share Wulu the people? Benefits. Does it say here the Royalists? But well, it's got the Kingdom of Walud. There's the Royal Knights. Yeah, they do look like that, huh? They do look like that. And now that these crystals are officially property of the Kingdom of Walud, we are duty bound not to interfere, no matter where they might happen to end up next. Interesting. Did you get all that? They're in cahoots! <laughs> so it would seem. My lord, what is the meaning of this? Double crossing dogs. They're not here to do business. Kill them. Kill them both. You're gonna have a bad time with that, my friend. This one. Bing bong. This one. Me to do that. Hi -ya! It's not over yet, Uncle. Da, 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 da. I'm just getting warmed up. Come here, sir. Someone doing magic? Sounded like someone was doing magic over there. Get up. New enemies approach. <gasps> Chocobos! Don't bring those nice fellas into this! They never asked for such a pleasant reason. Awesomeness, thank you so much. Thank you so much for 76 months. Holy moly. Oh. Come here. Get him. Awesomeness, thank you so much. Welcome back. Welcome back, my friend. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Well, that wasn't too bad. How'd you like my performance, huh? I've often played the villain on the stage. I think I did the role justice. Don't you? Graybeard, you are magnificent. The battle scene was particularly thrilling. Josh and Such Duhamel. a shame you didn't Apologies. have more of an audience, but perhaps that's for the best. How long There's all your watching? crystals, my friend. Long enough to witness your uncle's sordid transaction. I hardly expected one so venerable to degrade himself so thoroughly, <laughs> buying one's way into the confidence of degenerates. Ingenious. This was the trouble you spoke of. 
the men of the rock taking crystals men for the common folk and conspiring with the royalists. Well, yeah, those fellas are... Now it's over. In bed Indeed together. Indeed it clearly. is. The people of Dalamil had scarcely any means of redress against Kupka's men, let alone a foreign army. Until you two came along, that is. That's a lot of crystals, man. Well, we'd better get these crystals back to town. We're you gonna be the heroes. With them while I fetch a wagon. We're gonna hand them all out to the people, right? Can we scatter them? Can we be on like a cart and go here, Tows people? <laughs> Claim your crystals. Heat your stoves. Light your hallways. I guess not. I was it hoping for a parade. I still don't know your name, Clive. Anonymous. <laughs> Holy crap! Thank you so much for gifting ten subs. Holy crap! Thank you so much. Stinky. <laughs> Large bacon sandwich. Really, Kevin, Nightheart, Bronze Raptor, Bundy Duck, Chica, Paris, Mexican, Lumberlord. Welcome to the Lambs. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. So, Sid the crap. Second is a Clive. <laughs> I suppose it could have been worse. He's making fun of well, my name. Well, Clive, you held up your end of the bargain, so He's I must do the same. making fun of my same. name. Passage Welcome, through the friends, South whoever Gate, that was. was not? Thank you so much. To tell that the is truth, you've helped a little there, too. Many of the guards have already been redeployed to deal with the issue of their missing comrades. And those left behind have been encouraged to look the other way should you attempt to pass through because they don't want to get Thank you. smushed like an apple pie and allow a... me to cover your costs on the side of a... uh, you still yeah. have the purse i gave to the soldiers i trust i saw you pluck it from one of the bodies <laughs> oh dear wow, is that really so obvious too? and my name is not graybeard it is lord byron rosfield thank you very much no thank you very much Graybeard. Double the. <laughs> Here, wear this. Oh, getting a new brooch. I love new brooches. Desert Rose from Lubor. Any friend of mine who sees you with it shall be a friend of yours. Thank you, Lubor. I'm familiar. And please, feel free to send one of my stolices back to your people. Tell them oh, that nice. Rosina Dalamil is back in bed with Sid. But not like, I'm not going to use that wording. <laughs> not going to say that exactly. Oh, me, I lost the land. To his Achilles. Dude, they're so cute, though. It's storming like crazy. I am jealous. I would love, I would love that. Although my power will go out if that happens. But I'm trusting you, Sid. It would be great. Or should I say, Clive? So be sure not to let me down. I have a reputation to uphold. <laughs> yeah, it's a face of like, ah, oh, made a new friend. And we have an well, ad then. in 20 seconds. I wish you a safe journey south. Hurry it up, Blue Bar. Thank you. <laughs> not at all. It was my pleasure. Come on, Uncle. Let's oh, this go. is going to be perfect timing. Ad starts in 10 seconds. Look at that. Perfect timing. Perfect. Unless they start talking again after this. If they do, I'll just pause it. Woohoo! Look at that! Oh, side quest. How many? Two. Ooh. <laughs> Two. <laughs> Papa D, thank you for 71 months. Welcome back. Thank you so much. I hate to stand somewhere pretty for you guys. Oh, this is pretty. Enough. We'll stand next to her. I am. I love this game so much with all of my heart. All of it. Uh, there is an ad playing right now, so I'm just gonna be right back real quick, um, and then we will continue our journey. We got side quests to do, people to shoot. I don't have a gun. 
<laughs> I will be right back. Papa D, thank you for the 71. And Anonymous, thank you again for those 10 gifties. Super kind of you, my friends. Perfect time. Dude, I love seeing Stinky. Stinky is my favorite thing to call people. It's my favorite thing. Thank you so much. Hen gifted is huge. Thank you. Thank you so, so, so much. Positive Juju, 67 mark. Nick Dinosaur. Dinosaur. It says dinosaur. Reaver. I Erode. I rode. I always forget how to say Iro's name. Every time. Uh, Connelt, Planet Green Eyes, Ben Ben Lit, Olympia Kos, and Chalupa Batman. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome home, my friends. That's it's super true. kind what of you, dude. It's like super what duper kind. Thank you so much. Wait, does he have three what speed is bubbles? It now? Oh, nothing. Don't be a stranger. <laughs> No, I've never even forged a button. I don't want to. Actually. Perhaps Forge Master Luba's having fun at my expense. I wouldn't put it past him. Wouldn't put it past him. Neither would I. Oh, we listen. Wait. We listen. You when there's world building. Sorry. Work. I'm Sava, Master Luba, soon to be former apprentice. apprentice. If I don't pass this, people Passing are buying up pass. weapons faster than the Briar's Kiss can forge them. He wants me to make okay. a carving knife, one that embodies the spirit of Dalamil. Oh, it's got to have a lady on it, like a pinup girl. I don't suppose you have any idea what he's on about, do you? Pinup girl. I'm afraid not. Never mind. Uh, I, I will surely you help you, you like. my friend. Yeah, I'm gonna help. I know I'll how help. busy the Briar's Kiss has been, and that Lubor needs all the capable hands he can find. I'd be a fool to refuse. So, good question. Mm, and then there's this little riddle to keep in mind. 
the spirit no. of Dalamil. The way I see it, there's only one way we'll be solving Lupor's puzzle. Dude, this man speaks in we puzzles. Need information. He's like all the hobbits. All the better. He's like You're all right. the hobbits. There's no point fump now. Well, there's plenty of folk in Dalamil who. There's the butcher. Of butcher. course. And they're bound to have an opinion or two about the tools of their trade. All right. I'll talk to every cook I can find. All right. Let's hope there's someone. All right. We're going to go talk to cooks and butchers about knives and what it means to, to be a Dal Dalamil spirit. Spirit of Dalamil. Trust Lubor to take a simple test and turn it into a riddle. Right. I'd better get to it. He is the My worst. Carpets have the the most absolute worst. Herbs and spices from the A flasher. They're called flashers? Welcome, sir. What can I do you for? A question, well, if you I don't did. mind. What? I need to know what makes a good carving knife. You a blacksmith or something? Something, I suppose. Fair enough. <laughs> knives, is it? First and foremost, it's got to hold an edge. Most knives will make it through fat, no problem. But <laughs> sinew dulls cheap steel in no time. Okay. Give me a blade which can slice through anything that crosses my chopping block, and I'm a happy woman. Sharp. So a knife that stays sharp. <laughs> hmm. hmm. Makes sense. A sharp knife. I would never have guessed. What a curious thing to say about a knife. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> uh, Made that's the, the other side quest, right? Won't ship, won't crack. That's, the, that's the other one. I'm pretty sure. No matter how rocky the yeah, road. someone in... So, wait, where was it? It was, like, right here. Oh, it's probably just telling me it's asking me. Wait, inside. Ha, they've opened the We're gate. We're looking... Lubo was true to his word. Hey, shush. Shush. Oh, shush. Way back I gotta talk to this guy. Please. He's a hunter. What is it? Me no move for chatter. Sorry. My bad. Hunter. I have I'm a question. Hunter. Can you tell me? Good carving knife. Um. Has to be able to put up with some punishment. Punishment. Don't be dealing with a brittle blade. Your knife Not snaps brittle. every time you use it. You'll be spending coin as fast as you make Strong it. Strong and hard sharp. As it is. Got Thank it. You. I All business, eh? <laughs> so, a carving knife should be hard wearing and hold an edge. Hardly a revelation. <laughs> Let's hope Sava had better luck than I did. Oh, people like Silver knives pet. that are sharp and Bikes don't and break right away. That's weird. Why would anyone say such a brave Fresh thing? Bread, warm from the That's oven. crazy. Yes, they're quite sort of. Is it true what I'm hearing? So, you learn anything useful? Only that a blade should be durable and stay sharp. <laughs> All the cook said was that he needs his knives to be light. Mm. Too heavy and they do his shoulder in. That's fair. So we're no reasonable. better off than when we started. Perhaps Lubor didn't mean anything with his Dalamil remark. But that can't be right. <laughs> I've bandied enough words. No. No doubt you're right, but I have to make a start What if it's soon? sand? What if you what if you do a glass knife with sand in it? Agreed. A crystal knife like that much. with sand in it. Right. I've been trained to work iron. The trouble is, mm -hmm. it's either durable, durable or, or it's light. light. Meaning someone is gonna be disappointed. Is there no one else you can turn to? Eh. The other apprentice is no better than to help me with a merchant. A merchant. A favorite of Forge Master Lou. I bet she knows the metals. Okay. A merchant who sells metals. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh my god. How far away is that? What the fudge? Okay, I did. <laughs> Person's just like hanging out in the desert. It is a hot take, Cam. Super hot take. Let's go. Hanging out in the fallen structure, are we? Pork chop in truffle sauce with mushroom and potato wedges. I can make this jump. Ugh. Fine. Dude, it's so pretty. Can I? Oh, frick. I went out the wrong way. I didn't know they weren't connected. Do 
Back to the stables, girl. Just uh, so I, I gotta go. I gotta go out the front, the north gate, past Briar's kiss. Don't get stuck on Briar's lips, Nam. Okay, good. Ba -da -da. All right, let's try that again. <laughs> Faster. Are people living in here? Wow, would you look at this? I mean, it's, I guess it's a place to rest, right? How are you, Snake? Any luck? Well, what I asked her, but... If you're looking to make a knife that will impress a master like Lubor, there are options, they're just not that viable. Mm. Featherlight adamantite knives will get passed from generation to generation. Never needing so much as a lick of that adamantite ore mm. is unique to ash. Mm. So it doesn't come. And it's beyond my skill to handle. I see. Unique to ash. Are there any mm. materials unique to Dalamil? Unique to Dalamil. Something which could be mixed with iron to refine it. What are you getting at? The spirit of Dalamil. You said the Lubor dude? trained you to work iron. Then that's what he'll expect you to use. Yeah. But he would have known that it would either be too heavy or too brittle for a carving knife. Perhaps his Dalamil remark wasn't a riddle. If it's cheap it was metal hint. you're using, then there's always limestone. I... Limestone? Folk first settled Dalamil to get it a mint hand. Mineral if deposit. If you know the trick, it can melted be melted. In the bloody burning. hell! That must be it! Mm. I don't suppose you know the trick, do you? It's hardly my speciality. Huh? Okay, she's going to teach like him how to do it. I've got some learning to do. Clive, I... Uh, I hate to ask after all that you've done for me. Limestone. Besides. Limestone. I want to know if this is the answer to Lubor's little riddle. We're like really heavily invested. For I can't <laughs> thank you enough, Clive. You'll have no for trouble finding limestone guy. over in the terraces. Then I suppose I'll meet you back. Right you are. All right, let's go head over there. Do you crush up? That looks far. It's all the way over there. I'm just gonna teleport. We go out the south gate. Although, does that not trigger the next part of the main quest? Well, this is no good. Was is it true what I'm hearing? Maybe not. Take a sniff. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Needed to a silken soft. Take a sniff. I do not want to sniff you. Lights and words. I will not be sniffing any people today. Or maybe I will. Bella hates it when we I should sniff, get going soon. It really bothers her. When I go, she gets really mad. That is freaking ah, bright. I'm not too late. What is it, Lubo? A question that I neglected to ask earlier. Uh -huh. Where is it that you're bound? To Drake's Fang. To finish Hugo Kuka. <sighs> Just as I thought. Then allow me to share a secret. Yeah. Drake's Fang is currently riddled with royalists. So mm -hmm. Meki and Walut are allies, and as you have seen, their soldiers work hand in glove. Mm -hmm. But no nation has ever before allowed a foreign army to make a barracks of its holiest of holies. Not by choice, at least. Mm -hmm. And there's more. My man on the inside of the Fang has failed to report for several days. I fear there may be more trouble lying in wait for you on the road ahead. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> I'm actually happier. Isn't there about always? That. If you're determined to beard the lion's den, then promise me one thing. That you will enter via the mines, where the guard is lightest. Sure. I've lost one Sid already. If I lose another, people will start to think me careless. Oh, he does care about me, guys. Dying. Look at us. He cares. He Not cares about Kuka us. Not before does anyway. Well, so long as you have a plan. I have a plan. Murder's my plan. Bye-bye. <laughs> I got a plan, and it's destruction. But in the name of the good, people. The name of the good. Drake's Fang should so be bright. just beyond these springs. I gotta pick up Shall limestone first, dude. On? No, 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 no. I gotta get limestone first. 
Damn, this place is gorgeous. Oh, man, look at that. So pretty. One rock looks a lot like another. But hopefully this is what Seven needs. Exactly, Jog. Exactly. Exactly. The more the merrier. The bigger the bad guy, the we happier I am. I guess I might as well pick this up, seeing as I'm right here. Oh, a bathhouse All those guy. Years of toil. Are you all right? The baths are closed. On second thought, perhaps you are just what I... That depends on the job. I'd have Where you save my business. The baths. The water's turned scalding hot and all the crystals in doubt. I've no mm. doubt that my woes stem from the water's... But I can't go and investigate for fear of my customers, thinking I've... I'm bound to these baths in more ways than okay. one. I okay. beg... Okay. Sure. It's All probably right. like a uh, fire we'll elemental a or something Wonderful. in the Leave water. the market by the south like gate. It. The smell of these baths are all that my livelihood. My Got it, sir. Right, Crosser? I've never been to a place that has water like that clear and the, the blue green. I would love to. I'd love to one day. Fresh bread. Warm on the oven. Fresh it bread. would make a fun. My carpets have brighter I wasn't sure how much you'd need. I got all the lamps I hope this down. is enough. Here you go. You're welcome. Maybe he'll make me a weapon. You are one of the good ones. You and that merchant both. She's got quite a gift for teaching that. Now, times. Let's do it. Let's see what happens. Ting, 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 a ding, ding. I'm actually kind of invested in this. Like, <laughs> Ooh. I'll do, I reckon. A knife forged from the very rocks of Dalamil. Her spirit, if you will. It's a fine-looking blade. <sighs> Beautiful. I only hope Master Lubor agrees. That sounds like my cue. And just as well. I was getting tired of waiting. Let's see what I'm he thinks. Sorry, Forge Master Lubor. Let's take a look. He's taking a look. First things first, Sava, do you think this is a carving knife worthy of... I... Yes. Uh, but, but what do you... What do I think indeed? It's sharp-ish. And it's heavy. Heavier than it should be. You might not think it just to hold it for a moment, but sell that to a cook and you'll never hear the end of it. It looks like someone paid a visit to the terraces. Mm -hmm. The limestone was a step in the right direction, granted, but... And I was so certain I had it all worked out. Damn, what did he want? I don't know who you found to teach you that little trick, but it certainly shows initiative. Well, that's a good thing. Next question. How much do you think I would charge if I'd made this? Two dollars. Well, if it took you even a fraction of the time it took me, I would say you could demand a... And Happy birthday. And who would be able to pay that? Oh. Mm -hmm. The butcher, the hunter, the cooks over at the inn. He wanted something cheap. Dalamil is home to humble traders, not wealthy he lords and ladies. He wanted a humble knife. Rule number one in any business, Sava: know your customers. Yes, Forge Master. This is just about passable, but only just. I'd say you're worth keeping around a little I longer. I thought we were on to something. Starting tomorrow, you'll have an anvil of your own. I will. Oh, well, look at that. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I was wondering, uh, what would you do if you were asked to forge a carving knife? I'm curious. I'd do what I always do. Ask who it's for. If it was for the butcher, I'd make sure it holds an edge. For the hunter, I'd make it as tough make for the cook tough, light and as for a the feather. nobleman. Huh? Make it expensive. That makes sense. Mouth there movement. There goes a master, all right. It looks like congratulations are in he order. Loves him. I couldn't have done it without you. So You're much welcome. for the forge, the spirit of Give Dalamil. me something cool. Had meaning. You've passed your test. And when I do, he says he'll carve me the, the carve me crap me crap me the finest finest knife. I don't really need a carving knife. Maybe I do. Maybe we can start carving our prey. Goblin coin, would you look at that? We can sell it. Economists are, are, economists are, won't 
to argue that currency-based commerce is a cornerstone of civilization. If true, this coin would suggest that goblins are far more civilized than humankind gives them credit for. Or perhaps that humankind is rather less civilized than we presume. Oh yeah, that's facts. That is facts for sure. Okay, so now where are we going? We're going over here. I gotta run all the other way. God dang. If only I could use my wonderful steed in this town. I would probably Made run over a child, so it makes sense. Platters. I would probably run over a child. Finally, we'll be able to get this. We should get going soon. I'll definitely take a child out. I couldn't even Let's see go. With all the limes though. Where, where was this thing? Oh, it's all the way around and it's oh Come sorry. On, girl, see? Like see? Almost took him out right there. It's not a child, but person. What the hell are those? Things? See, I told you it was them motherfudgers. I told you. The fire boys. Ooh, Three desert roses. See, I haven't ran around in this place before, so... Oh, almost took you out. <laughs> Be careful. Be careful. This is nice. Wow. Dude, this is so pretty. Isn't it gorgeous? By the flames. By the flames. That explains the heat. <laughs> Oh, wrong way. Do it. Wait, don't do it again. You're gonna hurt me. Someone's trying to hurt me. I could feel I could feel them. You're too fast. Yeah. Mm. Too fast. They're all gonna explode. Normally I wouldn't hit bombs with like fire. Over here! But doesn't seem man. to be too much of a problem. Ow! Ah, what the, 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 the. <gasps> Who's that fella? Whoa. Wait, hold on. I want to fight this fella. What? You... Oh, ow! Fight! <laughs> There's a good boy. to take to get a license to ride the chocobo i would love to do that that would fill cool me with down a bit. joy let's hope it's enough to keep the baths from boiling i guess we can get the house 
I just want to go pick up the shiny thing over here. Fly Ambrosia. <sighs> Look how pretty it is. Man, so pretty. Wait, I can just teleport back. <laughs> what am I doing? I can just teleport. I don't need to run all the way there. Those floating flame and jack o' lanterns are your favorite. I like the well, I like the blue one. This is no good. Is, is it you, true what I'm hearing? Guy. The finest fabric. Take a sniff, good sir. Fresh bread, warm from the oven. Take a sniff. A pen license. I was hoping we'd be the baths grow more bearable by the moment. Mm -hmm. I'm that's glad to hear business. it now. Glad to hear. Tell me this. Not what I expected. That's what. It's exactly what I expected, actually. <laughs> it's exactly what I expected. You tell her fine. That's not to say I don't believe you, though. Creatures, but I burdened you with my worries and... What does he give me? Right. It's high time I... What does this man give me? <clears throat> Oh, he gave me this too, which it allows me to craft one of the things I've been wanting to craft. Okay, that was that's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. That was actually a pretty decent reward. I'm not mad at that. Okay, so I have 1,200. Um, I'm gonna upgrade this. Oh, it's, now I'm broke. <laughs> hmm. Now I appear to be broke again. Dun, dun. All right, it's time for us to go to Drake's Fang, everybody. Sweet Wanted insects. to double check what, the what? side quest. We should get going soon. Okay, let's. Come on. Yeah. Come on, girl. How many potions do I have? That's fine. That's more than enough. <laughs> I say as I die to something. So we are going through the mine, heading to Drake's Fang. Not to destroy the Mother Crystal at this moment in time, but to take down the Titan Dominant. Do you think they attach and reattach his hands? They probably have some weird kind of funky magic to do that. And then also the guy who know who called me Mythos, which is very curious and strange. Jaw obelisk activated. Any new lore? New lore? New lore? Drake's fame. One of Valacia's five remaining mother crystals located in the Dalmachian Republic. Unlike its sisters who jut from the earth to tower above landscape, Drake's Fang is completely enclosed within the vast hollow of an ageless mountain. Its citrine fingers reaching inward to the barrow's heart. Excavation of these crystals has, over centuries, showered the Dalmex with substantial fortune and as such is seen as a symbol of the nation's prosperity. No, he was carried out, Mustard. He was carried out by the Lord there Commander is Walud. Drake's Fang. God damn! Cuckoo will be hiding inside. That is uh, that's pretty big. Along with goodness knows how many guards, all on highest alert, you'll need to keep your wits about you if you're to reach him. So be careful. I will, Uncle. You got it, boss. Before you go, Clive, allow me to apologize. Oh, about what? After what befell at Phoenix Gate and the crisis that followed in its wake, I fled. Mm. I retreated to my counting house and danced attendance upon the Vicerine in the hope it would bring me favor. I betrayed my nation to save my skin, like the coward I am. Mm, I get it. And I'm sorry. Uncle, please. It's okay. 
Mm -hmm. well. It's not too late, Clive. Rosaria is yours by right. And there are those that would help you to take it back. I don't know if Had I the courage of my brother, I might already have done so. But that ship has sailed. You, Have however, you been trying no. for three hours straight, Cam? Forgive me, but I cannot. I fight to build a new world We're now. building a new world, man. New world. A better world. Where men can live and die on their own terms. Yep. I was raised in a nation that strove to improve the plight of bearers. Only later did I realize that spark of freedom did not arise by chance, but was kindled by my father. Damn. You would see me follow in his footsteps. Dad's a good man. And that is exactly what I mean to do. Not by ruling Rosaria, but by extending his ideals to the whole of the twins. Though every soul in the realm may judge my actions heresy, I am certain my cause is just. Let's go, Clive. You that really was beautiful. You really are just like him, you know. I miss Dad. Thank you, Clive, for coming back to me. I am proud to call you nephew. Well then, this is where we must part ways. Wish me luck in convincing my Canvarian friend to share his considerable talents. Good I mean luck. to plunder his coffers and prove myself worthy of a place in your merry band. He wants to join my merry band. I would love it. Till then, my boy. Till then. Go safely, uncle. Yeah, please don't. Please just be careful, okay? And you. Nephew. Be careful. We have much to catch up on, you and I. I shall expect you to regale me with the tales of all your adventures when next we meet. <laughs> You're on the same part, same cutscene? You can scene? regale me too, Torgal. <laughs> nice, Marquis. <laughs> <laughs> How much more money is this guy gonna get? He's a lord! So he's got all the money in the world. I assume. Now I'm it's time for business. For you. Business time, yeah. everybody. Now let's get down to business. To defeat Titan Mane. Boom. Bum, bum, bum. Any side quests anywhere that I'm missing? Okay. Let's go to Drake's Fang. Off we go. Yeah, just a man and his dog taking on an army. Exactly. We have no other people with us now. Hey, that's freaking massive. Go! Did they sew him back on, or are those fake? What are they stored? What has that guttle rat done to me? What's the, what's the what's the lore on those hands? Out of my sight, witch! <laughs> There's the boy. I'll kill you, Rossfield. Dang, he's got heart. no ass at I'll all. Tell you. Limp from limb! Peace, Hugo. The table shan't hurt you any longer. He sought to humiliate me. Me! If you hadn't interfered, he would be dead! Thank you, you for the follow, Lottie. You truly would have triumphed at the Sorry battle for the follower-only mode. Titan would have ground him into dust! I hate it. And how would he have done that without his head? Not Shut very up. handy. You weren't strong enough. And you call yourself a dominant. Or rather, you did. You mock me, Harbert. I don't know 
know what he did with his you hands. See, They're made out Hugo, of metal now, I guess. You are weak. Fuck. His hands were chopped off. But so long as that fire burns within you, there is still hope. My PlayStation. There is may yet chilling. be a way for you to take your revenge. Tell me, what must I do? He's gonna say something about Ultima, probably. Please, I'll do anything. Just tell me. Something to do with Ultima? You can free Ultima? The heart. Oh. <laughs> what of it? A mother crystal's heart is the most concentrated source of ether in all creation. Perhaps you could take advantage of that. Of course, the crystal would not yield her blessing to any ordinary man. Okay. But then, you oh, are no man. ordinary man. Him. Oh, maybe Zamnis. Stole your power, but yeah, others maybe. have suffered a similar fate, maybe. and still managed to find the strength to conjure their icon. Like Benedicta Harmon, she too drank of the ether and gained a power. Beyond human understanding. She did. Mm hmm. Looking pretty likely. this guy now we do we do his name no he we just knew him as lord commander before now he is lord harvard lord commander of the kingdom of walud's armies harvard is known to many as the constant knight by reason of his unchangingly icy demeanor and his unwavering loyalty to his liege indeed he appears to command barnabas complete trust having been gifted full command of the royal order of knights despite his apparent youth the capacity in which he evacuated Hugo from Rosalith Castle, however, remains a mystery. He's very easy to play like a fiddle, right? Because he's just, uh, he's just got a one-track mind. You mention Benedicta, and he's like, ah, yes, Benedicta, I must destroy. <laughs> Girthy bicep, thank you for the follow. <laughs> Sorry for follow-only mode, I hate it. I don't want it, but I have to. Mythos is here. Mythos is here. See? Very well. It shall be so. He keeps calling me Mythos. You may leave everything to me, Your Majesty. What in the fed intonation? Okay. Okay. Drake's fang. Dark. <laughs> Very dark. It's been it's been a long time, yeah. It's been a long time. Although he seems kinda dumb, you know? Just got like pure power. Because I'm cold, it's making me like shiver. Oh, that's a lot of. Oh. Ha! Oh, oh. Who are these guys? Do we have lore on these guys or who they are? Oh, it's Laura on Torgal. Highest faithful friend who is fiercely protective of him in it. However, it emerges that he is much more than a mere scent hound. He's a rare frost wolf imbued with the sorcerer's strength. He's able to call upon to Venezuela in times of crisis. Okay. 
I did see the Torgal plushie. Yeah, I did. That's pretty expensive. These guys are orcs. funny looking. Oh, they're orcs. Yeah, no, that makes sense. Yeah, that that does make sense. He is dumb as a rock. Yeah. <laughs> did the royalists bring them from ash? Zach, it's so good. I've been having a blast. Excuse me, sorry. Yeah, it's been great. We're getting into the juice. Are the Those are orcs. Are part of the Waluda army now. How the hell did that happen? Any chance? Why are we sneaking when we're just gonna fight them anyway? They spotted us. We need to go. Mechia's finest, the orcs. Another case of the Mondays. I'm sorry, Pack. I'm sorry. Oh my god, Zach. That's pretty good, actually. That was pretty good. What's that funny light thing? Bing bong. Who's this guy? He's a mesmerizer. Did he play uh, Guild Wars 1 nearly? It's gotta be a chest in here, right? Maybe? Aha! Better orcs than orcs. Oh shit. Where am I supposed to go? Out the door. No, not out the door. But where am I going? I got lost and distracted by a loop. That's just, dude, you think that, like, you think that dodging is going to make you faster, and it just, like, never does. None of the chests have been mimes. <laughs> yeah, oh, mimics, yeah. I was like, mimes, mimes, mimes. That's what they're called. Who's 
spitting at me. about cactars we did we did learn something about cactar needles earlier yep. something disturbing uh, something I don't recommend trying at home with any kind of needles. Ooh, the favor of lightning, lightning rod. Won't be going any further this way. Nope. Through the door. Okay, good, good. Lots of dead people in here. Uh, stairs. This must be the way out. Who's this big guy? Orcus father? Oh, he's not even a big guy. Over here. I can't even. I can't even see. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Uh, it was just, uh, we were, let's just say, um, we were in a place that has a very prominent brothel. And they were advertising cactar needles. Ah, <laughs> oh, no. Nice. Oh, okay, I wasn't, one. wasn't ready for that. How did I wasn't ready here? for that. Oh, it's on cooldown. Whoops. Oh, whoops. Wrong button. I can't see a goddamn thing. Oh, that was 
was a big gun. Okay, alright, well, okay, my bad. I messed up. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm also messed that up, too. too slow. What you doing there, buddy? I messed up that, too? What I want resting yeah she is resting she wasn't doing so good so we have not brought her with us for this at least that's a big fella <laughs> by the flames that's what i'm saying orcs we got lauren orcs a warlike yet surprisingly organized species of beastmen native to ash they've long been in conflict with the Waluders over control of the continent and currently count the folk of its eastern half as their own however the encroaching blight continues to eat into the amount of livable land making the fight for more territory even more vital there we go come on togo orcs Da -da -da. Wow. Kuka never did do things by halves. As if taking the mother crystal for his own wasn't enough. He had to build his castle in it. Dude, that's crazy. Place is massive. <laughs> Oh, look who it is. <laughs> Let the trial begin. No, no, this again. Oh, boy. What the hell? With me, Tom. Oh, you've got AoE. I see. 
Yeah, he it does turn pretty slow. The favor of lightning, thunderstorm. This would make it do a lot of damage. That thing does a lot of damage in general. Do we have lore on Iron Man? No. no. And now they let me in. Seems we're expected. So this is the power of Muthos. Muthos is what it's called? Well, okay. I swear they've said, I swear they've said it different every time they said it. <laughs> Muthos. Muthos. Is there any new lore? Muthos, oh sheed. The name by which Ultima addresses Clive, it appears to be his title for the vessel for limitless power that he means to make of the young Lord Marquis. But to what end he requires such a thing, only Ultima knows. Okay. Mystery. Did the orcs do this too? I'm gonna say the orcs are not the bad guys here. 100 gil. That will get me all the records I could ever want. Oh! Oh, whoops. I forgot which one I was on. Bing, bang. Steel silk. Any shinies over there? I don't. Oh! <laughs> I don't see any shinies over there. Hello? What the hell is going on? Are these things here for me? Or for him? Hey, Khan! Reminds you of Kingdom Hearts. I've heard that a few times. Yeah, Fufu said that. 
Bravery. Some opponents will use the ability Bravery to invigorate nearby enemies, enhancing their performance in battle. Okay. I want this guy. Oh, wrong button. Oh, this is where he uh, opened the box with Benedict's head in it, huh? I think. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. First orcs are these nightmares. Is this your doing, Ultima? Yes. <laughs> yes, it is. Can I open this door? Wait, what was that? A lich. Oh, one of these guys. I remember an ad in 40 seconds so is he transforming in combat he was transformed during that okay i'll be right back nothing's gonna happen i will not let you miss anything i'm gonna play the ad now because it's gonna happen in 30 seconds anyway god damn it and i will be right back i'm gonna get a little bit more coffee and then we're gonna kick some big ass i think big ass
party. I love dance party. Destiny servers are really having a hard time. Really? I thought it was okay today. They took him down yesterday for like a short period of time. Um, I thought today was okay. I do wonder what's going on, right? I do wonder. Cause uh, yeah, they, they're struggling a lot recently. Yesterday I was doing a deep dive and we had tier 5 beat the boss and I got baboon arid which I got kicked out, connected back, put me at the very beginning and you couldn't get the chest. Yep. Yep. We got 20 seconds so while we are waiting for the ad to finish, let's take a look at how many points I have. Uh, I do like this but leveling it up just makes the window bigger extends pre precise execution window, which I don't really need that. Um, I do really like this. I might get this again. Actually, you know what I was saving for? I was saving to master this. I want to put this on something. Because this is a ton of stagger damage. That's what the these stars are does a ton of stagger damage that's four stars what else is four stars three two two three two is that the only four right now oh huh. well i'll be damned that's what i'm saving for all right we're back we're back in business Gotta check all the doors, you never know. This looks like an important door. Glad I waited for the ass. <laughs> well, this is a beautiful place. You've been oh. busy, Kupka. Yeah, that's a smash table, all right. It's still standing though, so that's some pretty good crap. Where did you go? It's pretty impressive. Wow, it's just the sitting heart. right in front of the heart, right outside of your window. He's in the sanctuary. I can feel it. Come on, Togol. The favor of Earth upheaval. Well, 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 well. Would you look at that? Uh, I'm on performance mode. I can't really do quality because, for, at least from what I could see, it was making the motion blur look worse, and I'm just too used to the 60 FPS in combat. Kind of want to use this. I might use this instead of this. I use upheaval a decent amount. Performance mode, the motion blur is a little bit better. I'm just wondering what's down here. A lot of the time you can find like some kind of hidden, not boss fights, but like mini bosses. Okay, never mind. This is the way we're supposed to go. <laughs> never mind. Never mind. Oh, hello. Just what I needed. This one. Stay down. Ow. Ow! 
Can I parry this? Okay, it's, it was slower than I expected. <laughs> Get him. Yeah, they are. They are doing something with the motion blur. This one. Robo kill. The 60 FPS in combat, like, really is a huge difference. It's so nice. Mm -hmm. My everything. Damn, he really I, loved her. I've missed you so much. Koka! Parted again. I feel like you're head. being used, Kuka. I feel like you're being used. Blit. That is your. Ooh, hey. You. You got away from her. That's one way to trigger uh, him transforming into Titan. That's one way to do it. Oh shit, he's priming. turn that down that sound gets really really bad it like actually kind of makes me feel dizzy after they're done with the very high pitch so i'm gonna turn that down I'm just a tiny fella. 
What are you doing? the ability brimstone hold and release tri triangle <laughs> square and r1 to emit a violent explosion hold longer to increase the explosion size and strength press x at any time to cancel okay if it is invulnerable to damage while charging brimstone surfing attack will trigger the explosion okay okay let's give this a try not bad Nice. All right. Oh, brimstone's on cooldown. Big 
Bong. Oh. Ow, I was in the middle of an animation. gonna become Ether Titan. a wide open field which uh, seems interesting yeah if reads tiny compared to that guy the music what the heck <laughs> thank you for space 60 months Where's his head? So I don't know. Me. He's like, I'm tired, man. I'm coming to oh, see! What the heck can tech do? What the heck can tech do? Oh my god! Ow! I'm fine. Oh, hello. Hello, Poppet. Oh, 
Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Dude, this is crazy. Shit. Especially them switching between gameplay and cinematics, like, perfectly. Ow. That hit me a little bit. The transitions are so good. Like, I can't tell the difference. Oh, fuck! <laughs> Oh my god! This Don't bob your head, can't! with us. large fella. 
<laughs> He's a friendly mate fowler. What is he doing now? He's gonna bitch slap me? <laughs> Try to. Oh my god, this is great. Hiya! What now? He's gonna punch me!
how's it going? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, 
I thought you were getting ready to hit me. But it wasn't. Not really. What the hell was that? That is like the, that is such, a, not only is that an incredibly cool fight, it's so freaking long. It's crazy, a masterpiece, seriously, right? Like there's just there's so many different phases. It starts out as like a normal kind of icon fight. And then you take to the sky and you're fighting the massive dude. And then you're like, yeah, it just keeps going. It just keeps going. <laughs> it should come with a bathroom break warning. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, look, <laughs> three-parter. It keeps going. Yeah, it's, oh my God. Holy crap, man. It just kept coming and coming and coming. 
You're like, okay, that was really cool. Oh, okay, that was really cool. Oh. I remember when I started this, I was like, I'll fight Titan real quick and have dinner. <laughs> oh my God. Like, come on, dude. There's no one doing this. This? This is crazy. This is crazy. I was mashing R1, yeah. Oh my goodness. I feel like I need to have a cigarette. I don't even smoke cigarettes. I felt tired after that fight. Exactly, Golden. It's just like the music, the shifts of the music from like the da 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 to the. Wow. Greatest sex of my <laughs> without having sex. <laughs> Was there an ad during that fight? It says we've got an ad in 16 minutes. And I think I ran the ad right before we started that. So I think we're good. I, I, don't, think a, I don't think an ad happened. Oh. Yeah, that was, the music was incredible. The switching between cutscenes and actual gameplay is so smooth that you literally don't know when it's going to happen except for like the health bar popping up. Like, that's crazy. That was, uh, yeah. <sighs> oh, I don't know what to say. I'm lost for words. Guess we might as well break it while we're here, am I right? He has a sword? turn it down i need to, i'm gonna turn that down for you guys that will actually give you some of you a headache we'll read the lore real quick <laughs> dominant of the icon titan after losing his hands to clive's blade in the crypt of rosalith castle he was spirited back to dalmechia by his enigmatic waluda ally lord harbard clive followed after storming kupka's stronghold in the heart of drake's fang to finish him once and for all the duel that ensued first with Titan, then with something even more terrible, and led not only to Kuka's long-awaited demise, but to that of the nation's mother, Crystal. Uh, I turn that down. I definitely understand his headache when it happens, yeah. Okay, stopped. Oh. My head hurts, so I turn it down for you guys, but I can't do both at the same time. Huh? Is that you, Ultima? What do you want? Your soul is tainted with worthless human will, yet your thirst for power remains undiminished. With every sip you take, you grow in strength. And soon you shall Batman achieve yes. perfection. Wait. I don't know what you're talking about. You will accept us, Muthos. It is inevitable. You were created for this purpose, and you shall serve it. Never! <sighs> Substantial, it cannot exist in isolation. 
you mitigate its weakness by interweaving it with your consciousness. We believed we had merely to purge you of your will to claim our vessel. It appears we first have to sever every thread of the consciousness that supports it. No matter. The time to build a new world is not yet upon us. We will contemplate. That sounds bad. That sounds pretty bad. Uh, that sounds pretty bad. Yep, that sounds pretty bad. Hmm. Do we have any new lore on Ultima? No? We got a new lore on Vessel. A name that is be a name that the being known as Ultima gives to Clive, it appears to be synonymous with mythos. Well yeah, he wants to be in me body. I don't want him in my body. He's Thank weird. you, Joshua. Thank God for Joshua. Oh, is this guy? <laughs> One can no more command the power of ether by drowning in its flood than one can constrain the tides by standing in the sea. Mm -hmm. I had thought Hugo wiser than this, but it seems his head was full of rocks after all. Titan was strong. Your Majesty. Ah, oh, the Walud Odin guy. But Mythos is stronger. For five years, that man lived only for revenge. Clinging fast to a fiction, even as it swept him into the abyss. One cannot change one's nature through force of will alone. Only the Almighty can do that. Hold that thought. Okay, that's not Nular. They're just telling you who it is. It's Odin. Odin's dominant. Dominant of Odin. Hugo Kupka. The man who gave his life for a woman's head. Yep, it was definitely them, Xemnas. It was definitely them. A fool like all the rest. He has a tight ass. He's got a flat ass. Oh, that the death of a mother crystal should be so beautiful. It is pretty. Benedicta thought of Sid as she died, and Hugo never knew that. He thought of her as he as he passed. Holy Order of the Night's Dragoon. Oh, the phone. We got the lore on the dragoon boys. Elite troops of the Holy Empire of Sambrek, led by Prince Dion Lesage. Drawn largely from the nobility of the realm, their status as knights of the sacred dragon affords them still higher standings in the eyes of the people. In the Battle of the Borderlands in 873, as in so many conflicts down the years, they proudly led the charge as the Empire entered the fray. Okay. There's an ad that's about to happen because that fight took like an hour. <laughs> so I'm going to pause the cutscene. Uh, you can read lore on the Dominion. There you go. Um, I'm also going to put some rice. I'm going to wash some rice and put it in the rice cooker. So I will probably be the full three minutes. Um, please enjoy the lore. We want to make sure no one misses anything. So I will be right back. That was incredible. I also feel like I need to go for a walk, have a smoke, have some beer, drink some, drink some lemonade, suck a lemon. Good night, Sparty. I'll be right back.
All right. My rice is washed. My brain is clear. <laughs> Run ads before fighting dominance. Seriously. Oh my goodness. Oh. Ay. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Okay. You know how we were like, oh, uh, they can't possibly keep up this pace from the demo. Turns out they can. Turns out they can. Oh, I had a break. Some medicine, oh, it's the medicine girl. Medicine girl. I have salves, potions, anything you need. Stop bothering me, urchin. Or you'll feel the back of my hand. I need to watch everyone do that fight. Oh. <laughs> you must consider your health. I feel like I've worked out. If a show of force is needed to keep the Dalmex at bay, you may trust in your dragoons. I beg you to call on Bahamut only as a last resort. His strength comes at too great a cost. Yep. The Empire agreed to an armistice with the Republic, and yet the Emperor still plots its ruin. For now, the Dalmex suspect nothing. And as long as I can hold their gaze, war need not be inevitable. But more than that, Bahamut is the champion of the Empire. When our people look to the heavens, the sight of him gives them hope. Can I give them murders? What's gonna... Oh! It's the first kiss we've seen, I think. Forgive me, Terence. Would that you were my master. But alas. I will always be your loyal servant. True, ghost. True. I feel really bad for Dion. Really, really bad. His dad's an asshole. His stepmom's like the worst person ever. Should the council's brazen maneuvering prompt the Republic to tear up their own treaty and launch a new assault, our soldiers would advance to meet them, cutting across the central aisles, but not in time to prevent their forces from breaching the southern defenses and storming Twinside. And so the capital would become a battlefield. Thousands of innocents would die. I cannot allow that to happen. There is one small mercy, at least. You will not be forced to do battle with Titan. <laughs> well, you're missing out. It was really fun. It was really, really fun. Would that I could avoid doing battle at all. A thousand pardons, your highness. What is it? Pickle juice snow cone? Good day, mate. How's it going? <laughs> Olivier has been made emperor. What is the meaning of this? My father's orders. What were they? Quickly! Uh, yes, Your Highness. His Radiance requests that Your Highness maintain position here and... Ah! <sighs> what? Is, well, this doesn't even, doesn't even make any sense, dude. It doesn't even make any sense. Sir Terence. Second in command of the Dragoons, the foremost fighting force of the Holy Empire of Sembrek. His sword remains ever at the ready should anyone be foolish enough to make an attempt on the life of his liege, Lord Prince Dion. Born to a family of minor nobles, Terence entered the prince's service as a squire before climbing the Dragoons' ranks. He and Dion are lovers. I guessed. I guessed that. Yeah, I guessed it. I guessed it. <laughs> he made a child an emperor, yeah. When he... Terence. Yes, my prince. Bahamut. I must Bahamut. go to the palace. Already your steed.
What is it now? Oh boy, what's happening? Oh! Forgive the intrusion, your highness. He made it. I know you. wanted you. to get rid of the emperor? At ease. We stand in the presence of the phoenix. Yes, sir. You wouldn't want to get your fingers burned. Bella's about to be here. I hope I'm not interrupting. She's going to be angry at not us. Not at all. Though I admit, I did not expect such a distinguished guest. How many years has it been since the remembrance ceremony? Twenty? I thought you long dead. Do I address a ghost? No. Many have told me that I look like one. But no. I'm alive. <laughs> Just. You like the flower, Betty? You like it? Prince Dion of the House Lesage. I have a tale to tell you. Joshua's like, he grew up to be a pretty strapping lad. <laughs> pretty strapping fella. Hi, Benya. We're going to the hideaway. Oh, there's hunts, everybody. Oh, she. Koopo. It's almost time for Donald Koopo. Donald? I meant Mickey Koopo. <laughs> Mickey Koopo. Is there any extra lore going on? No, okay. Just make sure. Just make sure. You never know. You never know. Oh. Out of the shadow. Okay, Bella is now laying down. <sighs> I'd better give her the but good news. But she's taking up, like, all of the space. <laughs> so... <laughs> uh... All right, we got a lot of stuff going on. What yeah, right, Sumnus? You'll never believe what happened. Um, fought Titan, uh, he drank the ether, he became ether drunk Titan, and then I drank the ether, became ether drunk Efreet, and, uh... Oh, and then Ultima showed up and tried to touch me, but I told him to get away. What became of Cook? And, uh, yeah, it was a pretty good time. I'm gonna Why go to the we forge heard anything? first. Try to stay calm. I'm sure we'll hear something. There's new. Oh, there's nothing new at the forge. Oh, well, never mind. I we pulled our sword out of him when uh, Joshua told us to resist him. We're seeing um, troops oh, hey, she's up. Nice. Let's see what we got. Oh my god. That's a lot of it's a lot of things. Is that a Republican war beast? It's Gribblekin. Well then, um, the Valkory Desert. Among Republican merchants, reports abound of caravans being crushed by a black boulder. But would earn the eternal gratitude not only. Been... Anyway. I'm gonna go to the desert then. Uh, where the fudge is the desert? There's the desert. Uh, it didn't really say where it was, though, right? Or did I miss it? Did I miss context clues? <laughs> oh, was he in the cattery? He is in the cattery? <laughs> uh... Reports abound of caravans being crushed by a black boulder. A creature indeterminate in nature, but quite decided in size, strength, and spite. He or she who took it upon themselves to seek out and slay the black mass would earn the eternal gratitude. Ah, it's just... It's just in the desert. It's just in the desert somewhere. All of these are in the desert somewhere. Although this says question mark.
But the rest are in the desert. This is in the jaw. Empty hovel, the cattery. And I guess we just go to the desert. Go ride around. Go ride around in the desert. Ride around in the desert. Okay, so one of them is here. One of them's here. I might go here, because this might be, like, the easiest one to find. See if we can find him. Kyoda, I need to watch everyone do that Titan fight. Like, every person who's ever lived, I need to see them do that Titan fight. Wait, is that him up there? Kinda looks like him. Just the guy just standing in the middle of the road ominously. <laughs> that, that guy. Hello. Be safe. Hi. Dang, he looks so cool. The nine of knives. I'm gonna get my ass kicked. I'm excited. Bye, see you. My blade yet hungers. And so do I. Come. Let us feast with the flesh. Ow, that hit me? Your feasting days are over. He basically does the same stuff as the other guys. Ah, nice try.
bing bing. Oh, I have a lot of money. You know what that means? I can buy a bunch of records. I can buy a ton of records. Oh, Those who kill for sport deserve no better. True. True. Yeah, he killed these guys. That's sad. Ah, uh, the other one is just the here somewhere. The cattery. Uh, I don't know where the cattery is. I don't know where the catter is. Somewhere with a lot of cats, I guess. <laughs> I do like Titan a lot. Garuda's still my favorite because you can do the, like all the aerial stuff that's going on with her. Uh, and she also does have a counter. I don't, and I don't, I don't use Titans very much because I have like so many counters. Run like the wind. I'm looking for a rock. I'm looking for a rock. I think <laughs> between the milk repository and the yard depot. Yep, that sounds about right to me. I'm just gonna run around the desert for like a little bit. They, they didn't say the North Desert, right? I don't think they did. I think they just said the desert. Oh yeah, the sand's super pretty. I don't know where this dude is. I'm glad I got to fight one of them though. I could go fight the S rank guy, and uh, but he's just in Rosaria somewhere, I think. Huh. Uh. That looks suspicious. <laughs> is that a suspicious rock? I have no idea where this dude is, and I have no idea where the cattery is. Just do a quick little, uh, a quick little look see. We're still, okay, we're still in the desert. Any suspicious looking rocks? Hey, Raymond, how's it going? Oh, this looks sus. This is sus. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind, I guess it's not that sus. Come on, order food and it smells so cool. No one really plays the same. Yeah, no one does. From what I can tell. I haven't been able to watch too many. But Tomo plays like totally differently to me. Ah, is that a rock fella? Hello, Mr. Rock fella. Be safe. Are you a turtle? You are a turtle! Oh my god, it's turtle pope. Fasted F Fastido Callan? Fastido Callan? What level is he? Well, Clive. Very important. Oh, right. What are you doing? You're, I'm the only one who messes around with my What? That seems crazy. To me, boy. What? 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 What?
Incarnation is going on! loves lightning's boring 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 hey external i only say that because it has no counters in the kit at all and i only want to use counters <laughs> so no i get it i've been watching some demons say like hey this kind of girl has pink and green hair yeah exactly yeah for that i we got it because of a charity i should have stayed in its shell a charity incentive. And I stuck with it because I ended up liking it, which I was honestly surprised about. So the other one is in the cattery. I, the, bro, I don't know where the cattery is. I wonder if it's up here somewhere. It might be. I do really like pink and green. I'm a big fan of pink and green. I thought everyone would use Titan because it's the one with a parry in it. So we're gonna go this way and just like see what's over there. I almost wish they did have more HP. I should just use, I should just do, uh, like never upgrade my sword ever. Just use the first ever sword. <laughs> Excuse me. How you doing external? I hope you're doing well. It's super satisfying. Yeah, it's super, super satisfying. And I love using Garuda with Titan because of the big, like, bang. 
And I love Garuda because it's a lot of airborne stuff. She's got counters. Oh, speaking of which, I forgot. Ha ha ha. Uh, you, get out of here. I can walk from here. Oh, I guess this is the cattery. You're finished. Those appear to be cats. They're cats. Sarah Pena. The cattery. <laughs> uh, you can equip your old gear, yeah. Yeah, you can. I sold a lot of my old gear. I don't know where the cattery is. Does it go away if I hit it? This game is fantastic. Like, I'm really surprised that anyone said anything negative about it, to be honest. I mean, I get, like, the RPG thing. Like, there's not as much RPG mechanics as people want. <laughs> Guys, I don't think this is the cattery. <laughs> I don't think this is the cattery. Where is the goddamn cattery? Where's cattery? Just show me where it is. Oh. like down here somewhere I think you go from here I think what's the nearest obelisk the jaw go from the jaw okay hey visions how you doing um I mean yeah I can probably make it from from this side I know there's a limit on healing items you can carry, but is there a don't use items mode and or some kind of fight loot bonus for not using items? Uh, I don't think so. Speaking of which, mm, I have two potions. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Good girl. <laughs> The game has been sad all along, my friend. The game has been sad since the first, like, hour. Okay. Let's see what I can find over here. played the demo last night and bought it immediately it's real good i think it sold a lot of people it sold a lot of playstations too i don't know if this is exactly the right way to go but i know that it's over here somewhere um it's it's down here it's like right there I mean, the game's kind of about slavery, so... <laughs> yeah. It's, uh, it's pretty bad. Wait, if 
if that's a potion, I actually kind of need that. Excuse me. It was not a potion. It's your first Final Fantasy. Nice. Where am I? Pretty different to others. It's pretty different. There's definitely some similarities, but you're gonna buy 15. I hope you enjoy it. Guys, have a rest. I think that's a big ass cat. <laughs> Grimalkin. Uh, I am so rich. I need to buy all the records ever. Play time for the pack, is it? Let me introduce you to mine. Now, Togo! Stay down! Get rid of all the little guys, then we don't need to worry about it. Although there's more things coming, apparently. Get parried, nerd! Damn, we missed it. Hey. 
Notorious marks. Oh. My first Final Fantasy was seven, and seven definitely set the bar high. Definitely, yeah. Said it super high. Grimmelkins have developed spots on their skin which render them nigh invisible as they prowl the arid savannas of southern storms. Said spots provide considerably less camouflage when prowling else elsewhere, however. Okay. <sighs> that wasn't too bad, was it, Toggle? Wasn't bad at all. That was great. Let's pet the good boy. Pat the good boy. You were right, boy. Final Fantasy experience was Final Fantasy 1, then 4, then 6. Pork, pork. Ba -ba -doo, ba -ba -doo. Okay, I need to go. I'm gonna go back to the home base. Uh, because I wanna find I wanna find the other two, but I don't remember anything about them. <laughs> I don't remember anything about them. Also. I figured we might have some gifts for us over here. Wanna go check out the gift? Can we make it? No. I was wondering if we could make any anything new, but we can. We're seeing troops amassing at every border crossing. Welcome to the patron's whisper. Come to claim your just desserts. Briar clamshell ability points. Wow. Many claim they wish to change the world. A few actually take it upon themselves to do so. You are an inspiration to us all. All yours. Thank you. Best of luck out there, Sid. 800 ability points. The combat being weird? What? How's the combat weird? Uh, I mean, I guess I can put stuff into this. I don't need to master it, though. Well, it's really easy for me because I just want to use things that have a counter. So, I just use whatever has a counter. Does that make the combat weird, though? So, we have these fellas. Empty Hovel Dalmak. Dolmechia. We have this guy. Rosarian ruins. My, I mean, my guess would be. Like I, I kind of know where those ruins are. Sort of a vicious falcon is said. Da, 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 da. Near an abandoned village in the fields of Korova. Fields of Korova. Dolmechian. Fields of Korovan. I mean, this is... This is the Dalmaki in public. Oh, over here somewhere. I see. Oops. On it. I was trying to get rid of the mark. It's overwhelming, really. Interesting. Um... Well, they're in here somewhere. So I guess we'll go do that. Um, ba -da 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 -da. Yeah, combat is as deep or as shallow as you want. So we'll just head in that direction and see what's up. I still don't have any potions. <laughs> Let me on, thank you. 
Maybe one of these or a potion. Whichever, whichever thing you find more fun is going to be the way to go. Whichever is more fun. And for me, it's all of the counters. So that's why I just use all the stuff that gives me counters to stuff. I've got the Titan counter. Using Titan because of the parry. Rook's Gambit for the counter. Heat Wave for the counter. Combat's not particularly difficult, Zachavis. Yeah. That's a that's my one like downside. So one downside is that I wish I could select a harder difficulty right from the beginning. But it gives me a reason to try out the new game plus, so. Which way do I wanna go? This way. There's no many I just have to keep checking my map all the time. Because you can end up running in the total wrong direction. Okay. So yeah, they're out here somewhere. Don't get surrounded. Oh, wow. This is cool. Let's see. Oh my god, these fields are freaking massive. Maybe over there. They said they were near ruins, right? Or over there. Thanks, I'm gonna Cal. fight this guy. near ruins the opposite side of the map by accident it's so easy to because it's so fast well now that you have a choke boat, it's really fast so there's a couple of places with ruins so i'm just gonna go hit them all and see what's up got some stutter in the hideout town areas yeah it's only really the town area for me that seems to have any frame rate this issues. Be easy. mostly oh put that no need to ride from here. Yeah. Oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> 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 Oh, you mother! You want to do that again? Huh? You gonna do it again? You want to do it again? Huh? You thinking about it? Sickly. He's gonna kick your ass. Oh yeah. Oh. 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 Oh.
mind. Never mind. Never mind. Well, they're not in these ruins. Next ruins. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, my bad. Haven't heard of crashes happening constantly. The only thing I've heard is overheating, but I feel like that's a skill issue. Just watch what's going to happen to me. <laughs> um, but now my PlayStation's been emitting cold air, if anything. Ooh, Be look safe. at that guy. I like fighting these guys. Yeah. Yeah. Princess is in another castle, exactly. Oh. Hi, Bella. Now, I can't see Bella. I can't see. <laughs> Help me, boy. You're a fine hound. Bella will certainly make things a little tough. I meant to do that. Pinkle. Anyway, I got distracted by uh by the girl. No strength. Hey, we gotta look for the things. I gotta go eat soon. Come on. I'll save the S rank for tomorrow. Because that'll that should be pretty fun. The amazing thing about human and enemy NPCs in games like these is that literally all they would have to do after attacking you and realizing they're outmashed is just offer you like a potion or seven gills, say sorry, and the player would probably spare them. True. I mean, they're not gonna be in here, right? That'd be crazy. That'll do, girl. But what is it here? A chest! Ooh, goblin points. I wouldn't. <laughs> yeah, I. It, it depends. There if it's a go. big boy, I'm gonna fight him. Because big boys are fun to fight. If it's just a bunch of little dudes. Ooh, is this them? Looks similar. Yeah. Um. If it's a bunch of little dudes, I probably would because they're less fun to fight. Like, I'm sure these assholes are gonna be a real pain in the dick. So stingers. Oh my God. What the heck was that? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I don't like that one little bit. Okay, I hit one of them one time. Uh oh. Who's doing that? Stop it. I don't like that. 
I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do this. God damn it. <laughs> you son of a bitch. I want to stab I'm nearly dead. It's over. Um, ow. <laughs> ow. These guys are annoying. Mosquitoes, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. I actually don't have that much money. I don't have that much. I think uh, those were the last ones lost. Um, for the desert. So I'm actually going to go buy one of the records really quick. I'm going to go buy one of the records. Um, um. Where's the, uh, the lady? Oh, she's all the way up here. My carpet. Also, let's get rid of that marker because we don't need it, and it's gonna be annoying. Sir, needed to a silken softness. Oh, where's all that? We're all oh, right. We. That's right. We killed them all. Gave me a little PTSD being swarmed by wasps. Oh God, dude. Good day, my lord. Not sound very fun. Yeah, I want this. An excellent choice. No, gotta catch them all, you know? We gotta catch them all. Okay, let's go back to the base. See if there's anything new that I can craft or collect or anything. Man, what a fun day. <laughs> what a fun day. Okay, let's go put what the new music in here. I don't Where think there is anything. I don't think there is anything for me to craft that's new or buy that's new. I should buy potions though before I forget. Now, now it sounds like we're in the desert. Is it business or pleasure? Yeah, that Titan fight was. Uh... I should buy them from her. That was a. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> You're rubbing me blind, you know. I don't even know what to say. I cannot find a better price than that. It was, it was crazy. It was, it was crazy. I should sell this. I, I reckon I can find a buyer. You got out else? I reckon I can find a buyer. You got out else? Got <laughs> out. Uh, your bug. I reckon and I can find a buyer. Goblin. I'm be thankful you got that much. Nice. I got money. How much money do I have? Does it tell me in items? I've only played Final Fantasy VII Remake. Pain. So is this is this one less sci-fi and more fantasy? It's on, Game then. of Thrones. Is that all? Game of Thrones is the vibe of this game. If the state of our Final Fantasy VII was go. actually, a lot of people said when it came out that it wasn't true Final Fantasy because it was more like sci-fi stuff rather than uh, than fantasy. Who's Ned? No idea. Sit the second. I trust you will forgive forgive me for putting you and your dear uncle to the test. I'm confident that a man of your position can understand the importance of earning one's trust, especially in times like these. For what it's worth, you now have earned mine, and I can assure you it shall not easily be relinquished. May this be the start of a fruitful relationship. 
It does, Zach. It actually does. Like, Final Fantasy VII is revered as this, like, the Final Fantasy, right? But at the time when it came out, people were really upset about it. It was a pretty big departure from previous Final Fantasies. And now it's heralded as, like, the Final Fantasy, you know? Well, I need to go eat, and I need to feed Bella and do her medication. She's going to start eating me if we, uh... If we do not go soon. Let's take a look. Mylan's probably going to be finishing up, right? Oh, he's continuing his game. Let's go raid Mylan. He's playing Marathon. Mylan's playing Marathon. Um, if you ever want to catch up and you feel like you've missed anything, I highlight all of the VODs so they stay forever and put them in a collection on Twitch. And then I also just export them right to the second YouTube channel. So those are up usually, depending on how long it takes YouTube to process, which can take a while because they're like five to six hour VODs. <laughs> um, it can take a little while, but I do it right away. I do it in the evening. So if you do want to catch up, it's on YouTube in a playlist. It's also on Twitch on the playlist. So it is everywhere. People don't like change. Exactly. Yeah, they don't. They do not like change at all. And I get it. I don't like change either. But sometimes you get fantastic things with a little bit of change. Thank you guys so much for all of the love again today. It's been incredible. That fight, I might just highlight that fight as well. Um, download it and upload it to YouTube. So that it's in slightly better quality than the export. Um, and just to have that fight. Because I know I'm going to be looking for people doing that fight specifically on YouTube. So <laughs> I might just put it up there as its own highlight. Uh, I will see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow I have physical therapy at 11. Um, so I'll be live after that. Physical therapy is like an hour. So I'll be going to physical therapy. Go into the post office. And then I will be here. So I would expect to be live at like 1230. Pacific? 